Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome to Game Tech UK. Well, finally, welcome to Game Tech UK. Taking a few days off, I uh, went camping at the weekend and I had this planned for this morning and last night, just after midnight, I set it up for the download. It went to a sort of landing screen uh, with a blue bar and I thought, oh lovely, turn the screen off. Woke up this morning and it's still there. So I've been sitting here for about five hours today, just like proper grumpy, like, oh, if I'd known I could have done something else, I could have streamed something else, it started going slower, faster, it reset three times, but it's working, and I haven't touched one single thing. In actual fact, to the run-up to Flight Sim, I've barely even watched any videos. People keep posting videos on Discord, and it's almost like I don't want to see it. Obviously, I've seen the trailer, obviously, I've seen bits and bobs, but... Um, I haven't seen anything, so this is all new to me, and I thought it would be important, especially with the way that I like to do things, a little bit more real life. I don't want to give you some glossy edited video where I don't show you how to do anything. I'm a noob, and I want to show and talk about any problems that we might encounter setting up our equipment, going through the tutorials, and I thought it was important to stream that. So uh, we're going to do it together. If we have to stop and reassign buttons, we'll talk about um, where we should put the buttons. It's, it's, it's us. We're playing this. Let me go through the hardware quickly that I'm using. So um, I've got my GT Amiga Racing Seat with the brackets. So if you go on the GT Amiga, the link is in the description. They do do HOTUS brackets that bolt onto the side. So I'm just using the back end of the GT Amiga. Obviously, I'm not using the front end um, for the steering wheel or anything like that. I'm just using the seat unit with the HOTUS brackets. I've got the Warthog HOTUS so I don't know whether you can see here on this side I've got the throttle uh, and here so on this side I've got the stick. I'm also you can't really see it off camera but there is a video on my channel. I am using the Thrustmaster um, TPR pedals as well. They're all bolted in um, on my nice new rig section. I've been, when I decorated this room, probably about, oh, it must be coming up to about a year, I designated this space with a monitor in front of me for flight sim. And it's been sitting there ever since. I haven't really had any flight sims um, to tempt me. I've been waiting for today, really. That's why I was gutted to sit down for nearly five hours and just wait for it to install and be proper grumpy. Also, I purchased a little while ago a Next Level Racing keyboard and mouse stand. I've bolted this down so everything, you can move it about and you can you can sort of twist it where you want. Um, but sort of everything is at hand. I've got the throttle there um, and I can just put my hand up there. Everything seems to be fine. A little while ago, um, I streamed just the tutorials on X-Plane, but I've done no real flight simming. So I am a noob. And I thought it was important to stream as a noob because that's the way I like to do things. Nice and real. If I'm gonna if I'm gonna encounter a problem, you'll probably encounter it. And between us, we might get the answer. Now I'm gonna go into flight training, of course. Um, when I started it up, it said, right, I found your warthog, I found your pedals, um, I found a keyboard and mouse. Do you want to use them? And I sort of said, yes. I haven't touched anything. The screen that I've got in front of me is a 1080p. When I'm up at the main desk, I've got a 4K monitor. So it's enabled, it said to me, you can have it in ultra, but it is 1080p. But that's not going to make too much of a difference to you because only I'm streaming in 1080p. Um, I will probably get a 4K monitor, but that's more for me than you. You'll see it in 1080p ultra, so that would be great. Um, I know there's 250, that's it, that's me intro done, thank you for coming in, I know there was about 50 people waiting the entire time that I was waiting, so thank you very very much to everyone coming in, um, feel free to share it, feel free to leave a like, I will be reading out comments as we go, but let's get on with it, so let's go into flight training. Like I say, I haven't touched any of this. I haven't seen anyone do any of this. It's all new to me. So we're going to go into number one. Basic controls and cameras. Familiar, familiarize yourself with flight environment. Now I'm hoping, because it saw the Warthog, hoping it's done, um, it's done some buttons for me. I don't want to go through and sort of assign everything. I need a little bit of help with that. Um, so let's get in there. That's what we're going to do. So we're going to get to know your aircraft environment. This training session will familiarize you with the basic controls to spread your wings. So we're going to explore different views around the aircraft, pitch and roll the aircraft using the yoke, skew the aircraft direction with your 
uh, add and reduce power with the throttle so that's what we're going to do actually this is very very similar um, to what we did on x-plane tutorials but I'm really excited because I honestly have I've tried to it's a bit like the last of us 2 I've tried not to look at anything and I know that a couple yeah press button 26 yeah I know that a few of you are posting pictures and I'm just like wow does it really look like that let's find out hopefully the views okay I'll put myself top right so I'm not in the way of any um, any any instruments hopefully um, it, it's, it'll be a pleasure to watch please give me some feedback on the sound let's get on with it and I'm here all day by the way I'm not planning on going anywhere I'm gonna be here all day I might nip off for my dinner later on but that's it I'm yours now for hours and hours and hours and hours so share it like it let's get on with it it's looking complex already we've got little buttons and numbers to let us know what things are <laughs> Oh, thank you, uh, uh, Beer. How are you? Uh, didn't you put your flight suit on? No, I was going to get a um, <laughs> a pilot's uniform. <laughs> and hours, yes. Yeah, I'm here all day now. If it had downloaded overnight, I would have been um, on at, at 10.30, you know, but I had to keep putting it forward, putting it forward. Flying is easier than pitching the tent. No, the tent's all right, actually. Right, here we go. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping buttons are set up. I really, really am. Okay, ready to fly. Oh my God, look at that, yeah. Oh shit, it's going down. No, is it? No, it's fine. Yes. Okay. Out your side windows. You can see we have great visibility over Sedona today. Right, I'm re oh god, hold 14 or 15. This is this is where it gets not Okay, it's that one. Okay. This is Red Rock territory. Okay, yeah, not a problem. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I I don't, I don't mind that. I'm used to it on the hat above there, but that's fine. That's not a problem. Okay. Use left, right, up, and down to translate the uh, translate the camera inside the cockpit. Okay. Um, okay, that's fine. So we can do that with the cursor keys, uh, and then we can look around as well. Okay, and press free to press free. Oh God, what's free though? What? <laughs> now we might be able to um, go to controls, and I think it tells you what number the buttons actually are. Two, one, two. Where's three? Where's three though? Um, oh, unless it's see. This is what I wanted to stream. Uh, you know, issues. Um, I wanted to stream that. It was important to me, so we can work it out together. That's the. Oh, here we go. Is it's that one okay is it that one let's go back no it's not that one it seems okay okay control alt and one by pressing three oh shit here we go uh <laughs> what buttons are for yeah exactly yeah trigger is free That's a bit weird, though, isn't it? Right. Hmm. Okay. Save a custom cam. Save a custom camera. Pressing Control Alt and one. Okay, where is uh, hold uh, hold one? Does it mean the butt? Oh God, which one is it? There you go. Visual confirmation on the airport. <laughs> where? <laughs> is it over there? Time to fly this bird. The first control on our training list is okay. the yoke. Okay, so far so good. We've got control of that. starters it controls the 
ailerons. And the ailerons, they allow the push <laughs> button to fire a machine gun. Portrait, yeah, we've done that. Yeah, I've done that. Go yeah, that's fine. Okay. Structure's too quiet. Yeah, I can turn that up. That's not a problem. I can turn that up. Here we go. All good. Good. Of course, the yoke also controls the elevator. And the elevator affects the plane's pitch, right? Is that the uh, runway over there? Pull back on the stick. The plane starts to climb. Give it a shot. The most valuable things in aviation are speed and altitude. But notice, when you're pitching up, your speed is decreasing. Yes. You could add more power. <laughs> what, a, now, what a voice. Turn it down again. Down. <laughs> okay, let's pitch down. Just like that. Your speed's picking up again. Just like that. Down. As you level back out, let's talk about another control. The rudders at your feet. Okay, which I have got, which is cool. Rudder pedals control the aircraft's side to side movement, also known as yaw. On the ground, those pedals are going to steer the plane left or right. Up here, they properly align us during turns. Cool. Try them out and watch the plane's nose skew to either side. Okay, so let's make sure the. Um... Yep, all the pedals are working. Simple awesome. Enough, right? So I'm using on, the Thrustmaster TPR pedals. Make sure your dashboard is aligned three to four inches below the horizon for a cruise attitude. Okay, got that. <laughs> your instructor died. <laughs> no, it won't be available on PlayStation 4. Hello, Sam. How are you? Finally, I know. What happens when you cut all the power? Surprise, oh, there we go. Surprise. Is that sound the better? Can you hear the um, the engine and stuff like that? Is it all good? This might be a good time for a piloting PSA. Always keep an eye on your surroundings because nobody likes a low flying duck. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go ahead and throttle back up. Oh, just watch. You'll see. Thanks, Codus, for bigging me up. Uh, we're going to play this all day, by the way. All day. How does it look? What, what do you think? What do you think? It's very... Um, it's not flat, is it? It's not flat. To increase engine... Okay, well, I've done that. Um, yeah, no, I've done that. Come on. I have increased the throttle completely as well I don't know why that is um there you go oh here we go <laughs> okay and as long as we maintain the same attitude our altitude will keep climbing too this is going to be You're cool really I'm here all day right control. I'm here all day I think I will need help. Plane, it's I'll VR soon. Yeah, the VR update is coming soon. You can pass me the controls when you're ready to finish your session. Or keep flying. I'm going to keep flying. Yeah, I'm going to keep flying if that's alright. I just want to just wanna have a little cheeky look. Oh, yeah. Let me just check. It, it, it's probably this TV. This TV isn't very good. Uh, let me just see what the preset is put it on. Uh, so it's put it on 1080 because I I've got 4K over at the normal um uh, at the at the normal uh, desk, but here this is a 1080p screen. So we've got that VSync is on 60. I think I could probably put the render scale up a little a little bit, possibly. Um, so, yes, yeah, just everything's up, isn't it? Okay, let's um let's put the render scale just up a little bit. And I've got the um, I've got the frames uh, per second top left. If that goes down, I'll put that back. Okay. Yep, 
Yeah, that's gone down to 46. No, let's leave it exactly where it is. They know, don't they? They know. I mean, the terrain detail is right up, so... Uh... Okay, let's just fly this around a little bit. Um, I was set, yeah, where well, it's all on high end, yeah, it's it's just on um, 1080p. You've left the training airspace, you need to go back. All right, all right. Yeah, but we want a 60 for the stream if possible. You can't just pull over, yeah. Oh, it looks nice though, doesn't it? And this is nothing, there's just still, still so much to see, isn't there? Okay, let's go down a little bit. Where's the... Uh, oh, there's a little railway line here. Let's go down. No, it's not a railway line. It's a road. Training airspace. You need to go back. Oh, I can see cars down there. Oh, oh, take away all the fun. All right, we're going to have a look down here then. This is nice, isn't it? The training airspace, oh, for God's sake. <laughs> God, you know, when you think of other flight sims, they just seem so flat, don't they? This is so not flat. This is, uh, this is very cool. Oh, shit, there's a... Don't worry about that. It's fine. Right, okay. Control, Alt, and X. Right, I have control. She Please has stop. control. <laughs> Pitching down so far makes me nervous. <laughs> right, we've done that one. And thank you to everyone who's in. I do appreciate it. Let's do the next one. <laughs> Your sick bag's full. <laughs> okay, let's go next. So, um, training menu. Restart next train. Uh, let's just make sure that is the, the next one. Yeah, let's go back to the training menu. Oh, imagine full in full VR. Yeah, it's going to be cool, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it was at, at, attitudes or alti attitudes, or is that meant to be altitudes? <laughs> Matthew Young, thank you very much, mate. I appreciate that. Come into Discord, Matthew. Um, let me know when you're in there because you get a few extras for uh, being a member. I appreciate that. Come on, that's it. Okay, so attitude and power equals performance. Okay. In this training session, you will explore the core fundamentals of flying, which I definitely need. We're going to do learn the main attitudes of flying. Uh, flying, sorry. Change pitch attitude to control speed. Adjust the power to control the rate of climb and ascent. Read indicators of aircraft. Oh god, this is going to be fun, isn't it? Uh, Brighton, sorry for being rude. What we said? <laughs> you got some attitude, bruh. Oh shit, oh god, we're going to have to have some work done here, aren't we? <laughs> Stay with me, I'm going to need your help. <laughs> yeah, definitely, Luke, looks good. What could go wrong? I don't know, I don't know. Flight Sim is coming out? No, it's already out now, It's it's, it's, it's already out now. Very steep learning curve, yeah. <laughs> Do as you're told. Right, okay, here we go. Here we go. So we're ready to fly. That all looks good. Yeah, I like that. Today we're talking about attitudes of flight. How your plane is oriented relative to the horizon. If you look outside, you can see the cockpit is just about four inches below the horizon line. Yeah, I can see that. We're flying straight with a decent rate of speed. Hmm. This is the crew's attitude. Let's see how it reads on your instruments. Uh, to focus on the instruments, I think they mean maybe that one. Does it? Is Take it that a look one? At the yeah. Attitude indicator. As the name implies, it shows your current attitude. 
The white line is the horizon, with the sky above and the ground below. Okay. That orange element in the middle, aligned with the horizon, that's us. That's your plane. Gotcha. Come on, we can do this. Just like we saw outside. Our current attitude. I don't know what you're talking about, Brian. Where is the tackle? Like we're pushing around 2300 revolutions. Which one's the tackle? 23, 23. Combined. Uh, Tachometer. Engine RPMs translate to aircraft performance. Which leads us to your airspeed indicator. Okay. <laughs> the engine was a bit up in the air. Check your altimeter. To figure out your altitude, you always want to read the small okay. needle first. Little one is thousands. That's it. I got that. That's it. With our current attitude and power output, we're holding a speed of 90 knots and a stable altitude of 6,000 feet. But that's about to change. Take the stick when you're ready. Oh, take oh bloody hell! Take the stick, right? Okay. Pull back slightly on the yoke to raise the nose just above the horizon line, about two inches. Make sure you don't pitch up too much, or the angle will be too steep to create lift, and without enough lift, we'll stall. Back there, back there. All right, go full throttle and start climbing. Thank you, Potter. I appreciate that. Come into Discord. <laughs> I'll make you green. Thank you very much, Potter. The Welcome throttle the is full. Attitude. Yeah, here we go. Thank you, Potter. See how it shows up on your attitude indicator and tachometer? According to your altimeter, oh, yeah, yeah, we're yeah, here gaining we go. altitude. But we're losing airspeed Whoa. even at full throttle, proving you can't avoid basic physics while making a climb. Okay, before we go on, let's get back to a cruise attitude. Ease up on the yoke and aim your nose just below the horizon. Then throttle back down to 2300 RPMs. Oh, which one is the... Which one is the RPM, though? Oh. 2300 RPM. Oh, is it over there, isn't it? Oh, God, how can we focus over there? I think it's that one. I think it's just over on the right. I think. Oh, you greened up, Potter. Thank you. And aim your nose just below the horizon. Then throttle back down to 2300 RPM. No, that's the clock. No, just there. Oh, no, it says RPM. It says RPM. Uh, on her side. Yeah, it's just over there. <laughs> right, just below the horizon and 2300. Nice job. There you We're go. Now set up with the same attitude and power we had at the top of our lesson. Next up is the descent attitude. Start by reducing your RPMs to 1800. <laughs> Flappage! <laughs> then drop the plane's nose a bit further below the horizon. So reduce to 1800. I've got that. Right, there's 1800, that's it. Okay, so just below increase. Oh, so we're going to go back up. Okay, 2300. I love this. <laughs> I'm loving this. This is brilliant. It's 2300 just about to hit now. There we go. There we go. Now that we know how to cruise, climb, and descend, let's talk about the turn attitude. Gently pull the yoke left or right to start rolling the plane. Okay. If you take a look outside, you can see how our attitudes changed, but you can also check your instruments for the details. As a general rule, you always want to keep your turns under 30 degrees. Hmm. At the top of your attitude... You need some tissues. No, it's fine. a series of notches representing 10 degrees each. Use them to control your roll. 
Notice the more you turn, the more you need to pull back on the yoke to maintain altitude. Yes. When you're rolling out, you'll need to do the opposite. Roll and push at the same time. Oh. Oh, okay. You know I got gotcha. you. Attitudes of flight, the closer you get to that pilot state of mind. So keep practicing. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. Done, pass me the controls. Okay, so we're pulling up a little bit as we turn. And as we straighten up, we're just pushing forward a little bit. I like that. Yeah, I like that. I, I, the thing that's got me is the fact that it's just so not flat. The terrain is, is awesome. I can see a little bit of the way it's rendering, though. And I have got it all up on Epic. Now, I don't know if that's my TV or whether that is... Um, whether you can see that. Can you see them sort of rendering lines? I think it might be my TV. I do need to upgrade to 4K. Uh, sitting here, it's just a, t a 1080p we had. Right, okay. Let's, uh... We can give it back to her now, can't we? Oh, reduce it. I've got you. And then push forward as we straighten up. I like it. Right, let's um, let's give it back to her. Thanks, I've got control now. She Why has not? control. Turn it down to high-end settings instead of ultra. Yeah. Oh, you can't really see it. Okay. Why would I want to turn it down though? I mean, I'm getting, it, I'm getting 60 as it is. Well, I don't know why I'd want to turn it down. We can definitely try it. You saying it will just render it a little bit better? Let's go back then. Let's go to the training menu. <laughs> it looks canny-like. <laughs> Uh, there is a VR update, yeah. There's a VR update coming. Hitting like 30. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, cool. Right, so we're going... Oh, taking off and landing. Oh, one of my favourites! <laughs> there is nothing like the thrill of taking flight. A training session dedicated to getting you off the ground and flying straight and level. Taxi into position and take off. We're going to manage attitudes and power to fly at different speeds. We're going to accelerate and decelerate at a level altitude. Bloody hell, it keeps on about attitude and altitude. <laughs> Seven minutes. Okay, this is this is getting meaty now, isn't it? <laughs> oh no, I'm grabbing my popcorn. Thank you for coming in, everyone. You are watching a noob. Um, I have set myself up like I know what I'm doing. I think the, the term is all the gear, no idea. But that's going to change as we get on and enjoy the game. Um, hopefully you're enjoying this. I have done it as a bit of a noob sort of session. I haven't done any practicing because... You know, I want to I want to show any issues that we might run into and how we're going to solve them. It is PC at the moment. Oh, nice one, Dazza. <laughs> Brace for impact. <laughs> you feel sick just watching this. Do you want me to take the camera off? Right here we go. Okay, this is going to be fun. So we're gonna we're gonna be using our yaw here to steer, aren't we? Will take you a mile. A mile of runway will take you anywhere. Taking off isn't hard, but there okay. are a few key points to remember. Now this is steam version, actually. First, we always take off into the wind, which won't be an issue on a calm day like today. Second, yeah, I'm gonna um, do some stra uh, uh, train sim world. Tomorrow, actually, a day early. I'm gonna, yeah, on he on this channel tomorrow in the evening for two hours. I'm gonna be playing Train Sim World 2. I've already done the underground. It looks awesome. To focus on the runway. Okay. No cross traffic. Go ahead and taxi into position. The rudder pedals should make steering the plane pretty easy. Uh. Okay. Okay. Oh, turn off your parking brake. Control and numb. Uh. Okay. Where? <coughs> that one? Num decimal. Oh, num decimal. Oh, I've got you. Yeah, okay. Now, I take it we're going that way, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, of course we are. Come on, why is it not going? I turned the brakes off. Why is it not going? Um, okay. A line out. Why is it not going? Brakes are off. Um, 
I don't know why it's not going. Interesting. Uh, okay. <laughs> she wants to go. She wants to go. <laughs> Should we restart that? Should we? Let's restart it. Something went weird there. I'm sure of it. <laughs> Hello, Mark. How are you? Just map a button for the break. Yeah, I will do eventually. Yeah. Right, okay, ready to fly. How are you, Mark, by the way? Plenty of people in there asking for you. <laughs> a mile of road will take you a mile. A mile of runway will take you anywhere. No, no, I did turn the brakes off. No, I've already turned them off using the standard button. There are a few key points to remember. First, we always take off into the wind, which will be on a calm day like today. Second, before we enter a runway, we always make sure it's clear. Right, disen disengage, right? So that's off, it's fine. Everything looks good, no cross traffic. Go ahead and taxi into position. The rudder pedals should make steering the plane pretty easy. Okay, look, it's, it's just said that... Oh, no, it's doing it now. It's doing it now. We're, we're going up this way, aren't we? Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. No, it does work, Mark. It does. Now, they want the uh, brake back on, don't they? Okay. Okay, come on. I've done that. Stuck again. All right, let's do this. Apply full power, and I'll walk you through the takeoff as we go. Okay, we're going. Then we're going. Use your rudders to stay on the center line, and keep pushing power until you reach fifty-five knots. Right, fifty-five knots. Not a problem. Sort that out. That's easy. That's the one in top left, isn't it? Good. Now gently pull back on the yoke. Line up the top of your instrument panel so it's a couple inches above the horizon. That'll pitch us up and set a good oh, climb yeah. attitude. And we're airborne. Focus on Tracing well to uh, tomorrow Push night on the channel. Yeah, but um, probably about 8 o'clock, something like that. Maintain 75 knots. Target altitude of 5,500 feet in no time. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. No worries. We can do that. Oh, this looks lovely, doesn't it? Oh, you can see the little specks of sort of um, glass there, can't you? That's good. Right, we're going to go... Oh, God, we've got to climb quite a bit. <laughs> it's the landing we're waiting to see. Right, we... We need to go really high here, don't we? Yeah, the Porsche is uh, very beautiful. No, I think it's going to be uh, flight sim all day, really. I'm, I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to be streaming for absolutely hours. So, yeah, feel free to drop out and come back in. I'm going to be here pretty much all day. We don't want to climb too high because obviously we're going to end up stalling, aren't we? So we're just going to take it easy. It's all fine. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've got my car. <laughs> Download uh, about five hours. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Rockstar player. How are you? What's that noise? What's. What? No, don't do that noise. Yeah, I'm good, Rockstar, thank you. They say it is coming out for Xbox One, yeah. It's coming out on PC first, obviously. <laughs> obviously. Oh, look at that. That just... The, the terrain is beautiful, isn't it? I think it must be still... I think I'm climbing too high, aren't I? <laughs> Your mum's calling. 
Yeah, it's still, isn't it? I'm trying to rush to get up there. We've still got... We've still got time, don't worry. Oh, nice one, Mark. That's cool. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? When you coming back streaming, Mark? Until he hits it, yeah. Oh, yeah, I didn't mind uh, uh, waiting. I said I didn't mind. I've been proper moody all day, but it's all good. Well, it hasn't told me about any external camera buttons, um, so I'm just sort of waiting for that. Yeah, it hasn't told me anything about that. No, I'm not going to stall. It's all good. It's all good. Now, the 75 knots, that's the one on the left, isn't it? Yeah, it's the airspeed. So, airspeed is knots, isn't it? They're, they're telling me I've got to maintain 75, but maybe I'm climbing too high. Maybe I need to get that bit of speed up first. That's it. Right, now we're up to... 75. Ah, 5, That's it. Feet. A nice safe altitude for part two of our lesson. Straight and level flight. Yeah, I've got you, Mark. Well, at least you're healthy. Well, People worried that you was uh, unwell or... Yeah, but that's good. That's good, mate. Use the right to straighten up the aircraft. Uh, 5,500... Am I just being silly? Am I? Uh, are we currently at 1,200? Are we at 1,200 feet? We've got to go up to 5,000. Am I just imagining that, or am I reading it wrong? We're currently at... Oh, oh no, we're... <laughs> Tell me what altitude we are at the moment. I thought we was at 1,200. Will, you're at 7,000. That's it, 7,000. I got you. I got you. <coughs> I read it totally wrong. Yeah, way too high. It's fine. Right, we're going to take the speed down. Yeah, it's fine. Told you, noob. Right, it happens. It happens. You're in the you're in the heavens. About time coming up to see you, Pope. Yeah, well, I was getting mixed up. I've got that now. I can see that, but I was getting mixed up with the one that is actually pointing at one. Why put that in? Right, I've got this. I've got this. I'll fly it all, fake man. I will be flying it all. Don't you worry about that. Oh my god, look at the detail down there. Bloody hell. That is cool. Right, here we go. <laughs> He's reading the clock. Right, we're going far, far too fast as well. So we need to slow that down. <laughs> no soft cock landing. Right, here we go. That's it. We're in a cruise attitude, pushing That's it. max power. To stay leveled at our target altitude, let's start by easing the throttle back to 1800 RPMs. 1800, that's over there. Yeah, yep, got that. Altitude, you need to pitch the nose up. You could just keep pulling on the yoke to hold No, I want to trim it. That's not really a precise means of control. No, we want to trim, yes. Gotcha. You need to push or pull on the yoke. Drag the trim down when you need to set the nose up. Right. Drag it up to set the nose down. Which... Try adding trim to keep us at 5,500 feet without increasing throttle. If you feel our pitch slipping and need to get back to the proper attitude, oh, okay. don't worry. Just pull on the yoke, then dial in the right trim. That's not it. Is that it? Oh, there's the trim there. Oh, that's nice. That's nicely positioned, actually. I like that. Whoa, whoa. Get, leave off. Right, I've got that. Hello, Max. How are you, son? Right. Yes, perfect. I've got that. I've got the trim. Uh, we're Oh, okay. To keep the plane at 5,000. Right, we need to go back up. Oh, I like the trim there. The trim's good. No, it says uh, 5,500. We're only at 5,000 at the moment, so surely we need to go up.
No, we still need to go up higher. Unless I'm reading it wrong again. We're currently just coming up to 5,000 uh, feet, aren't we? So just putting that trim back in there. That's it. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm so relaxed here, I'm going to have a sip of coke while I'm doing this, it's, it's just in it. Yeah, exactly, yeah, but you said I was too high, Will. No, no, I'm not high enough, am I? Right, here we go, let's, let's, let's whack some power in there. <laughs> that is cool. go right so I'm gonna I'm not touching the throttle I'm adjusting trim now which is cool is there something where it shows me the trim or is it all just a very uh, intuitive thing that you feel is there a trim sort of meter how do I reset the trim you know meant the trim was too high right here we go here we go Yeah, it looks lovely, Max. You'll be able to get this, mate. Right, here we go. 5,500. Right, now we need need to lose some revs. Oh, look down. The uh, trouble is, I don't know how to look down. I, uh, yeah, I can look down there. Where's the... Yeah. Uh, 1800 okay so pull back just a little bit a little bit of power off we're at 5500 the revs are coming down the way I was taught when you adjust the trim you make rough changes at first to remove pressure on the yoke then small adjustments to find the perfect setting to keep your desired attitude that's the key to straight and level flight. It saves you from constant... Oh, yeah, like the wheel thing. The yeah, I see it. I see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see and it. That That's good. More time to enjoy the ride. If you want more practice using the trim, go for it. Whenever yeah, I got the round dress. Controls, yeah. I'll be here. Cool. This is, this is fun. I'm not in no rush. I'm here for hours. I want to learn this stuff. I don't want to just do this stuff. I think there's a difference, isn't there? I do want to learn it, believe it or not. <laughs> But is there a reset for the, the yoke? I just want to go down to some scenery. We're not going to do any any crazy crashes. Look at that water. Oh, my God. I'm not into crashing in the buildings. You, you will never see that here. But I do want to go down and have a, have a little cheeky look. Bloody hell, look at this. This is a massive jump, isn't it? On the last one, bloody hell. Yeah, yeah, this is good. This is good. <laughs> I've got an i9, uh, 32 gig of RAM and a Titan X. But the screen I'm playing on is only a 1080p, so I do need to replace this screen. Oh, it looks better the closer you get, bloody hell. Normally, traditionally, it's the other way around, isn't it? Looks alright from the sky, you start getting close, oh my god! You start getting close and it looks terrible. Here, it's the opposite. Nice! Oh, and there's just so much we can do, there's multiplayer, there's races. Oh, it's just gonna be it's gonna be cool. So I've just used the uh the trim there. That's cool. I like it. Look at this. Trim's like autopilot really, isn't it? <laughs> right, she can have that back. I think I'm ready, you know. She has control apparently. Oh gee, just as she was about to crash, she went, quick, let's go to the menu screen. <laughs> Yeah, really, very, very, very good. The water did look amazing, yeah. Yeah. Okay, this is fun. Landing. Yes, we want landing. <laughs> Sorry, you'll have to get used to me being a little bit excited like a child. It's fine. Landing's a strong point for me. <laughs> 
<laughs> here we go. Here we go. Oh, look, more than one person's put in here we go. <laughs> what are you afraid of, poor house? This is where it might all go wrong. And <laughs> tabs in. Oh, shit. Thank you for coming in, though. I do appreciate you all being here. I'd love it if you left me a little cheeky like. Like I say, I'm in no rush today. I'm here for hours, right? all day. So just chill out. Um, and come fly with me. Come fly with me. Right, let's go. My first instructor used to say the best part of flying is landing in one piece. <laughs> did he? Did he say that? Did he? Is that the airport hey, just there? Isn't it? Oh, nice airport. Landing. We've got clearance for a straight in approach, so we don't have to complete the standard traffic pattern. And I've already set us up in landing configuration. At 65 knots with 10 degrees of flaps and idle power. Flappage! <laughs> We're on the glide slope now. Maintain speed around 65 knots. Change right. your pitch uh, if you okay. need to. Yep. And keep your aim point on the runway number. When you're targeting the runway number, you want to keep it steady in your sights. If it looks like the number's moving up in your windscreen, you're coming in low. You'll need to add a bit more throttle to get back on the slope. If it looks like the number's moving down in your windscreen, well, then you're too high. What numbers? What numbers? What's she talking about? You'll need to add flaps to increase your rate of descent. We might have to do this one twice. you also need to push forward and trim to change your attitude and maintain the same speed. What, we still need to trim here, do we? Oh, okay. Press 23. <laughs> Brilliant. Don't you just love it when they do that? Press 23. Oh, press button 23, will you? 23. I mean, oh, flaps. Oh, it is actually in the flap section. Okay, that makes sense. There is a button here called flaps. I like the way they put that there. Okay. Um, up or down? Are we... Hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are we putting flaps up or down? Uh, we're putting them up, aren't we? We're putting them up. Can you let me know? In the chat, is it up or down? I think it's up. We're putting them up. Come on, I'm waiting. I'm waiting. <laughs> Gently hope. Yeah, it is up, isn't it? Of course it is. Oh, up, down. Gordon, it's down. Bloody hell, Gordon. It's down. Okay. Oh, I like that. That's good. That's actually on the flat button. I like that. Right, 65. We need to speed up. Bloody hell. I gotcha, I gotcha. No, I've already done. Move on from the flaps, move on. Right, we need more speed. Right, we're going to do this one a couple of times, alright? We're going to do it a couple of times. Keep your aim point on the runway threshold. When you're 10 feet above the runway, it's time to flare. Once we pass the threshold, shift your aim point to the end of the runway. Then, pull back slightly on the yoke to... I feel like we're coming in too fast. It. Should we have more flaps? More, oh god, this is... No, this feels wrong. I'm going more flaps. We're speeding up. No, this is, this is not good. We're too high to land. Well, give me a blood... SOP dictates we go around and try our approach again. Hang on, let me have a go, love. Get it with practice. What? Oh, come on. I had that. <laughs> yeah, you can use the airport lights. Yeah, yeah, I got you. We, we went through this the other day, didn't we? Why ruin it, though? I had that. Honestly, I really had that. Instructor used to say the best. <laughs> <of flying. laughs> the man was a terminal pessimist, but he wasn't wrong. Today, you're in charge of bringing us in for a safe landing. We've got clearance for a straight in approach, so we don't have to complete the standard traffic pattern. And I've already set us up in landing configuration at 65 knots with 10 degrees of flaps. And so that's power. fine to use trim to keep the nose down, the isn't it? Without having down. to keep pushing forward, is that right? Maintain speed around 65 knots. Change your pitch if you need to, and keep your aim point on the runway number. <laughs> you have to do exactly what she said. Runway number, you want to keep it steady in your sights. 
Yeah, so I'm, I'm using um See, she's so telling like me. The numbers moving down in your windscreen. Well, then you're too high. You'll need to add flaps to increase your rate of descent. Flappage. You'll also need to push forward and trim to change your attitude and maintain the same speed. Oh, I got it. Yeah, I got it now. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Not that much. No, it's fine. It's fine. Right. I think we're all right now. Yeah, I think we're doing all right. This is better, isn't it? I've got the speed she wants. I'm sort of aligning, I think. Keep your aim point on the runway threshold. When you're 10 feet above the runway, it's time to flare. Once we pass the threshold, <laughs> shift your aim point to the end of the... <laughs> She's the one with the attitude. Then pull back slightly on the yoke to aim the nose just above it. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm too low, I'll be honest. Um, We're past the threshold, but still a bit high. Keep reducing altitude. You should be able to start flaring the plane now. Keep pulling back whoa, slowly. Whoa, whoa, let the plane whoa, whoa, off whoa, the runway. Whoa. Don't push it down, but don't let it start climbing. I mean... Nice. Now apply the brakes to slow us down and bring the plane to a stop. She said nice, so, you know. I'm happy with that, yeah. Great job. As they say, any landing you can walk away from is a good landing. You but spilled your coffee. But if you the plane the next day, it's outstanding. <laughs> Landings can be hard, even for seasoned pilots. Trust me. Don't hesitate to practice. I'm going to do that After one more all, time if you don't mind. We're here for, right? Yeah, I'm going to do that one more time. That is, you know, I think I nailed it, but I really want to hammer it home. Uh, let's do, no, I'm going to restart that one if you don't mind. Because that was one I messed up and one that I got. I need to do it one more time. And <laughs> the Ryanair captain. <laughs> right, we're going to go again. instructor used to say the best part of flying is landing in one piece the man was a terminal pessimist but he wasn't wrong today you're in charge of bringing us in for a safe landing we've got clearance for a straight in approach so we don't have to complete the standard traffic pattern the one after this I'm stuck on oh Mustang and don't set us up in landing configuration at 65 knots with 10 degrees of flaps and idle power the two red lights. I still, I'm still working on the red light thing. Just, just go with me on that, all right? Knots. Change your pitch if you need to, and keep your aim point on the runway number. When you're targeting the runway number, you want to keep it steady in your sights. I should imagine this window's like ten months. Up in your windscreen, you're coming in low. You'll need to add a bit more throttle to get back on the slope. If it looks like the number's moving down in your windscreen, well, then you're too high. I don't understand this she, this bit. She, oh, numbers. No, oh, I'm but not sure what she's talking about. forward and trim to change your attitude and maintain the same speed. Sounds good as well, doesn't it? Well, that seems too hot and spicy. Here we go. That's it. Right, I've got it. Yeah, the actual number on the runway. Yeah, yeah. Should we go a little bit more flappage? Threshold. When you're 10 feet above the runway, it's time to flare. Once we pass the threshold, shift your aim point to the end of the runway. Then 
Pull back slightly on the yoke to aim the nose just above. No, you don't have to do two tutorials, but why wouldn't you? Okay, we're past the threshold. Start the flare. Keep pulling back slowly. Let the plane settle onto the runway. Don't push it down, but don't let it start climbing. Oh, come on. Oh, nice. yes. Now apply come the on, to let me... Down and bring the plane come on, let stop. me hear that one. That was, that was good. That was good. I'm happy with that. Yeah, that was fine. That was beautiful, wasn't it? <laughs> We're getting this. As they say, We're getting it. Right, let's move on. Day, <laughs> Seven. Are oh, you all holding up <laughs> scores? Are you? <laughs> John. Okay, that was sexy. That was good. Okay, on to the next one. Next tra uh, traffic pattern. Oh God. Okay. Traffic pattern. Oh, I've got an eight from Foxy. Look, nice. <laughs> yeah, we're not dead. Oh, ten out of ten from David. I'll take that. I'll take that. Oh, here we go. Okay. So we're going to take off. We're going to go around. This is exactly the same as uh, a lot of this is the same as the X-Plane tutorials. Because I suppose the fundamentals of flight and a Cessna, they are the same, aren't they? So it looks like we're going to take off, go round, and come back. <laughs> it's about £55 Elmo but you can get it on Xbox Game Pass and if you haven't got that you can just try a month for a pound so you know you can get it for a quid basically to try it oh this Let's does look honest, nice though no one likes are you pleased with the way it looks let me know in the chat you're a pilot training on traffic patterns Sedona's standard traffic pattern Follows a 1,000 foot altitude around the main runway. I need to sort that break out, but I don't want to. I don't want to assign something that is assigned to something else. You know what I mean? So let's get started. Uh, what is that? Sorry, I missed it. What does Alex say? What does Alex? What's he want? What's he want? Put him on hold. Well, right, here we go. And we're up very, very gently. And away we go. No, Ben, they haven't given the date yet. 54, gotcha. What did Alex want? Oh, I was, I was wondering how they was going to put their way markers in the sky. That's okay. Yeah, I like that. That's all right. Yeah, I've uninstalled X-Plane. Yeah, I won't be doing X-Plane. Right, I'm using trim here. That's all right to use trim, isn't it? Not too much trim, though. No, it's not an Xbox, um, Jack. Once we reach altitude, you're going to start turning left 90 degrees toward a 122 degree head. 90 degrees? Okay. Uh, yeah, sorry, Alex. Put your pass put your question in now. Okay, we're in the pattern. Get Hello, Daniel. How are you? How's my girl? Always use trim. I've got you. I've got you. Traffic pattern altitude of 5,700 feet. Ready to make your left turn downwind. And we've we got to push forward a little bit, haven't we? As as we turn. You're at a good glide distance. I mean, that feels right. We don't want to do any sharp turns. There's no reason to do a sharp term up in the sky, is there? So th this this feels right, I don't know if it is or not. Yeah, I think that was right. It's all about that slow movement, isn't it? How is the new game and what did you and what did you buy? I haven't brought anything, Hammer, just just the game. We've got the wind at our back now. We're on the right track. 
How much did the pedals cost? Um, well, all the stuff I got sent from Thrustmaster. The pedals are about 500 quid, and I think the Warthog is about 500 pounds. Uh, but I got it sent ages ago from Thrustmaster. All, all reviews for this equipment is on my channel. What, we're pressing flaps already? What? So that's the runway there, isn't it? Down there. So we're going to make our way... Yeah. Answer your son. What's up, Maxie? What's up? That's Sorry. Turn left again onto the base leg. What it is, where uh, in this situation, I'll just use a, um, a laptop for the chat. So I don't normally... I have a massive screen on its side, so I can see all the chat. With the laptop, I can only see about five messages at a time. Um, but, uh, yeah, sorry about that. Can I go on with Slim? Slim, are you going on? Do we have to go right up to that, do you think? A little bit of trim down. There's the... Oh, the runway's right there. Okay. Right. Reduce power to idle to start losing altitude and maintain cruise attitude. He is after his toilet. Okay, there. I can't see the that runway at the moment. Speed around 65 knots. Oh, we need to, we're going in too fast. Way too fast. We're getting a multiplayer session? Yeah, tonight. Whatever, you know. <laughs> Where's the runway? I feel like I'm coming in too strong. That feels low. That f that feels low. First bit of flappage. Bit of trim on there. Let's do some trim. There we go. The runway's in full view. Make sure to keep the plane centered on approach. If you're too high, add flaps. Too low, add power to maintain the glide path. Right, I'm feeling this is okay. I'm feeling it's okay. Oh. <laughs> oh. It wasn't bad. I'm going to do that one again if you don't mind. And we've got that to put on. That was all right. Yeah, it was fine. I can do better next time, though. Way to stick the landing. Now, just apply the brakes to slow your roll. And make sure you don't stop on the runway, of course. What do you mean, don't stop on the runway? What, what are you talking are about? To land, we've got to move. I don't know they why the camera keeps going up there. The right. Oh, we've got to keep going. Oh, okay, okay. Touchdown! <laughs> well, we've got to come up here. Stop aircraft on a taxiway. A taxiway is a parking, isn't it? Is that? Am I getting that right? I mean, can we go? Can we go here? Is that what they mean? Good job. As an old instructor said to me, not only did you not die, you're really learning to fly. Oh, she's getting right on my nerves. Oh, that was good. I'm going to do that again. Um, yeah, don't do that. I'm going to do that again, if you don't mind, because uh, there, there was a nice little bit of info in there. <laughs> and it's running on Epic uh, Hammer. Oh, I took um, Max off of Marshall because um, he was in uh, he was in off topic. Yeah, put him back on. Right, let's, let's do it honest. again. No one likes going around in circles. Unless you're a pilot training on traffic patterns. This is cool. standard traffic pattern follows a 1,000 foot altitude around the main runway. Yeah, I've got to sort that brake out, here, but like I said, I don't want to assign a button over something that the game is sort of deemed so to be the brake, so we'll, we'll stick with that for now. I do need a new TV though, because this TV isn't very good. It's 1080p, but it's just not a very good 1080p. It's an old 32-inch um, Toshiba, 
with barely any performance in it, so I will get a new TV. I doubt I'll be able to run it in Epic on 4K, but at the moment in 1080p I can run it in Epic. And up we go. Uh, how many can you have in a convoy? Will, uh, Will will answer that. This hasn't got a, um, uh, what's it called, like an undercarriage, is it? You can't put the wheels up on these, can you? I like trim. Trim just saves you bloody holding it back, doesn't it? Or ultra, maybe, uh, maybe I meant ultra um, snowy, yeah. Yeah, I don't feel that I'm getting the full beautifulness of it because it's not in 4K. You reach altitude, you're going to start turning left 90 degrees toward a 122 degree heading. Right, we're going to go, we're going to go slow like we did okay, before. Okay, we're in the pattern. Get ready to enter the crosswind section. Good. Keep going till you reach the traffic pattern altitude of 5,700 feet. Ready to make your left turn downwind? When the runway appears at the halfway point of your wing strut, you'll know you're at a good glide distance. You shouldn't need um, Marshall to go into chat, Max. It's a ton of work if you don't use the trim. Yeah, I got you, Billy. Yeah, yeah. Nice and slow. There's no reason to do anything fast up here, is there? It's not like it's a road. You've got the whole sky, so there's no reason to to do anything erratic. We've got the wind at our back now. We're on the right track. I think he just wants to go in one of the um, chat Over rooms of Slim. To a cruise attitude and reduce power to 2100 RPMs. 2100. Okay. A little bit Once of power your speed off. is in the white arc, add 10 degrees of flaps to prep us for landing. What now, though? Do I want now to do flaps now? Check if the I mean, good. okay. Oh. And it probably goes without saying. Always watch out for other planes entering or exiting the pattern. Oh, you can set waypoints. Okay. This joystick's so making my arm ache, making my wrist ache. <laughs> Yeah, see you later, Max. Air speed, air speed. Oh yeah, we need to speed up a bit is what you're saying, isn't it? <laughs> Don't mention waypoints. you got no choice in the air though, have you? God, that's really making my wrist... I think it's where I'm like so holding it so tightly. And it's a big, heavy joystick as well. Hello, Sandy. Oh, in downwind. Okay, Billy. Yeah, to stop it flying away from itself. Yeah. From twisting. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the pedals are cool. Quite expensive for what they actually do. I've always said that, but they are they are cool. I'll just do all right, it all, Brian. I'll do it all, mate. To start losing altitude and maintain cruise attitude. Right, let's get a terrible runway, attitude. You got white knuckle, turn. yeah. That'll also keep our speed around 65 I should miles. imagine that's what they say in a real plane, isn't it? Because you do feel like, oh my god, you've got hold of this, you know? How can I apply the brakes and not stop on the runway, though? Yeah, see, like Scarab, be safe, mate. Oh, I'm all over the place. Oh god. That's not right, is it? That's not right. I come in. A little bit. Too, well, I might be alright actually. Mm. There we go. The runway's in full view. We probably sure won't be. On it's fine. <laughs> yeah, let's if keep it centered. High, add flaps. Too low. Add power to maintain the glide path. Okay, so we're going to be we're going to be up the end a bit more. It's fine.
No, we're not pulling up yet. Not yet. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. That was that wasn't bad, was it? Yeah, I was. I'm pleased with that one. I think I'll move on from there. Yeah, I'm getting I'm getting used to that um, sort of landing arc. I'll use the tow brake. That's pushing it forward, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> Allegedly, uh, first solo flight. Okay, here we go. I'm up for that. Allegedly. <laughs> oh, so we're going to do this on our own. Okay, okay. Now, this next one took me a few goes. All right, well, you know, like I say, I'm in no rush. Hopefully, you're chilled out watching. Hopefully, you left me a little cheeky like. Feel free to share it. I'm a noob, and I'm, I'm approaching it as a noob. So, if I do anything wrong, we can hopefully learn from it together. Maybe you're getting it. Maybe you're going to play it later. Who knows, but let's just relax, play this awesome video game, it is very, very impressive, I must say, very impressive, and there's just so much more we're going to be doing with this, but for now it's all about them tutorials and just enjoying the game. Yeah, what could go wrong? Have you started the bad weather? No, not yet, no, that would be good. Right, okay. So we're doing it all, okay. I'll be watching from the ground in radio contact if you need me. But something oh, tells me, me you won't. Oh, me fucking yoke's gone. Your goal is to complete Sedona's left-hand oh, traffic <laughs> on your own. <laughs> Where's my yoke gone? What we covered in oh, our God. Sessions, and you'll be just it's fine. fine. We don't need the yoke. It's fine. Good luck. See you on the other side. I don't know where the yoke's gone. Oh, maybe if you press there. That's it. Okay. Okay. I got you. Right. Let's move that out of the way. So we're on our own. We can do this. That's quite good that you can turn all that off, actually. And nice point and shoot as well. Alright, we're not going to pull up just yet. We're going to keep that speed up. About 55 uh, knots we're going to pull up. Alright, we're going to start pulling up about now, nice and gentle. There we go. Whoa, whoa. Oh, so we're not even going to get waypointers? Is that what we're saying? Look at this scenery though, look. I'm going to use a bit of trim here. How much to turn on this one, yeah. So we've got no... I mean, have we got no waypointers like we had before? No waypoints. Oh, okay. All right. And she's not going to give me anything then? No hints, no nothing? Right, let's... We still need to go up a little bit more. Not that much. Not that much. That's it. Just going to turn gently here. Yeah. <laughs> she reckons she got it, yeah. Yeah, we're not stopping yet. I remember this from before. That's it. And we're just going to straighten it out nicely as we come down here. There's the runway on our left. We're going to trim it down a little bit so we don't have to keep 
holding that joystick. Speed seems okay. I'm going to put the flaps on because we're downward. We're on the downwind. What was your message, Jack? Sorry, there's a, quite a few messages coming through. I'm trying to um, I'm trying to get to them all. Okay. Bit of trim, just to sort that out. Right, there's our runway. What does it say in top right? Uh, complete. Yeah. So we're going to turn left. Not yet. We're not turning left yet. No way. Not yet. Yeah, you are going to need a fairly decent PC to run Flight Sim. And that was always the case, even with the old one. Uh, certainly when it came out. Yeah, airspeed is... Um, yeah, airspeed is an issue. That's it. Bring that airspeed up a little bit. Right, we're back up to 60, so that's fine. We're not turning yet. Not yet. Yeah, yeah, I know what you're saying, uh, I, um, Ivan, actually. Yeah, because when we turned, we was just, uh, there wasn't enough room for that last turn, was there? You're right, actually. Yeah, let's come over a little bit. Hello, Cayman. Codus! if we're turning just yet I mean I'm gonna turn I feel like we need to turn airspeed's okay Where's me bloody... Where's the runway gone? Where, that's it, that's it. I just don't know if I went far enough, actually. I don't know if I went far enough down. Yeah, that, that bit hasn't gone out, has it? The turn left for downward leg. Uh, yeah, okay. Oh, we're going in. Oh, bit of flappage, please. <laughs> dive, dive, dive. Yeah, but if a keyboard and mouse is what you've got and what you're used to, um, this is going to be interesting. This is going to be fine. It's fine, though. I got this. I got this, ladies and gents. Here we go. Here we go. And pull back. Now, I don't think that that is going to pass because it didn't. It didn't tick off. Hmm. You weren't really supposed to land there. Yeah. All right, it's love. Well done. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> don't That's get me wrong. It's a good attempt. She's patronising me. Best if we start the over. That's fine. I don't think I went down. Um, I went down on that last leg. It was a good attempt, though. She's right to patronise me somewhat. Yeah, of course it's playable. Yeah, of course it is. <laughs> See, Mustang says, yeah. Oh yeah, toe brakes. Yeah, so I can push forward. Yeah, okay, so a toe brake will slow me down on the ground, wouldn't it? Yeah. It's time, your first solo flight. I'll be watching from the ground. Listen, sweetheart, I've got this, alright? Leave off. Go on, go back to your you calf or whatever it is you're doing. Your right, let's go. Oh, bloody hell. Remember what we covered in our previous sessions, and you'll be just fine. Good luck. See you on the other side. Probably from the 52 website, I would say. Yeah. It might not be out yet, Jason. No one might have done a profile for it. I'm sure they have, though. Right, here we go. <laughs> She's probably never flown a, pl a plane in her life. Here we go.
keep climbing. 5400. No, we're not going to do loop the bloody loops. She's a glorified Siri. I know. Right, nice bit of trim there. You really don't get it? No, I, I got it. I just did it wrong. We, could, we did the first bit right, didn't we? Okay, uh, turn left to join the traffic pattern. That's it. So we're gonna. We're not gonna do it yet. Not yet. Now we're gonna slowly do it. We're gonna push forward just a little bit there. Nice and slow. So there's the mountains on our right. We're not ready to stop just yet. Now we're going to straighten up. Because we should have the runway on our left now. Let's have a look. No. Where the, where's the king runway? What? Oh, there it is there. No, we're doing alright, actually. Yeah, we're doing alright. Have a look on Steam, Jack. It'll tell you exactly how much. There's different versions, isn't there? I keep looking at the runway. Yeah, I don't turn left for downward leg. I don't think I did that, did I? Yeah. I mean that bit's fine, but it didn't tick it off, did it? Top left. So I don't think I did that first um, that first bit right. Oh, don't do that. We've got too much downwind now. That's why. Put flaps on. Whoa, it's like a bloody seesaw. Yeah, I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's um let's restart that one. Ejector. <laughs> Hello Deadly, you'll uh, you'll enjoy it, mate. You'll love it. Yeah, I think where I'm sort of turning where the one is. No, we need to carry on further round, don't we? Yeah. I think I'm turning too quickly. Sweetheart, you don't need to tell me nothing. Solo flight. I'll be watching from the ground in radio contact if you need me. But something tells me you won't. <laughs> I mean, this that game looks fantastic, but it's no bustin', is it? Remember what we covered in our previous sessions, and you'll be just fine. Good luck. See you on the other side. No, I'm not restarting the stream. Right, here we go. That's it. Yeah, yeah, I wasn't flying straight, was I? Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I wasn't flying straight at all. I did the corner and then very quickly did another corner, didn't I? This is epic though, isn't it? There's just so much more fun we can have with this as well. Once you start to open it up and... God, I'm only, I'm only just in the Cessna to start with. Are all the training... Um, is it all the training in the Cessna or is there other stuff as well? Use your compass. <laughs> Use your compass. <laughs> I put sat nav on to go to the shops, mate. So don't worry about using me bloody compass. <laughs> Hello, David. It's a Cessna. Oh, nice one, Stretch. Right, we're increasing up. Can you pan and look? Yeah, you can look around here. Um, at the moment, that's all I can do. I do need to... Yeah, we can do that. Flight speed is top left uh, of, the, of the display. Uh, right, here we go. So I'm just going to go forward a little bit. And then I'm going to do... I'm just going to turn left and then carry on. So basically I'm going to do a 90 degree, not a 180. So we're going to come up here. I 
Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. I've got you. Yeah, I've got you. Okay, we'll get that in a minute. That's it. There it is there. So now I'm going to go left about now, I think. <laughs> Let me tell you. I would. Guy, I know, I know you would, mate. I know. I know. God, I know that. Of course I know that. Right, does it like that one? No, I don't think it likes that either, does it? Put the flaps on. Just as we come down here. <coughs> What did I do? Um, what did I do wrong there? Because I felt like I turned. Oh no, it is fine. Yeah, no, it is fine. Okay, I have got it then. Cool. Right, we're going to get this. That is cool. Oh, this is epic, isn't it? This is like this is like Euro Truck in the air, isn't it? I mean, this has got us written all over it. Yeah, thanks for getting here. Yeah, yeah. I'm still on the tutorials, you know. Oh, hello, darling. Thanks, babe. <laughs> She's just done a captain sign to me. Thanks, babe. It was in a grown man naked. It's from airplane, isn't it? It's from airplane. Oh, you have. All right. See you later, babe. Yeah, it looks nice. What do you mean just now? <laughs> Get out. <laughs> Cheeky cow. Okay. Complete standard truck. Right, no, it's fine. We're not going to stop yet. <laughs> Meet up might get messy, yes. Yeah, flight attendant, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can fly anywhere in the world. Uh, as I understand it, D DGS, yeah. Okay, we're not going, we're not going just yet. No, we're going to carry on. I'm on this all day, by the way. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to be with you all day. Yeah, just ignore Simmy. Yeah, it, it, there's always one, isn't there? We'll see you in a bus sim stream. <laughs> right, there's that. Turn left. Now, so what we're going to do is... I've lost it. We're going to... Let's concentrate. Let's turn left. 90 degrees, not 180. That's it. And we're going to be like that. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's... Oh, I need to go a bit, a bit higher, I think. Oh, over Egypt. Oh, God. Yeah, there's so much we can do here. This is going to be awesome. Now, I think we can turn left here. Keep that altitude up a little bit. Where's the where's the runway? Oh shit! Oh, oh god, I've lost it. I've lost the runway. And I did that perfectly as well. It ticked it all off. Where's the runway? I think the runway's on on top of this hill. We can still do this. We can still do it. Yeah, there it is there. It's fine. It's fine. We've got this. I'm going to have you down on the floor in no in no time. I got this. I got this. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm a professional at this. Oh, come on. There's some toe brakes as well. Look, look at that. Oh, come on. That wasn't bad, was it? <laughs> it was an interesting approach. It was, but come on. Oh, God, they've got the fire Great engine job. out. There's always room for improvement. Hold my beer. But you did it all on your own. <laughs> hmm. You weren't really 
immediately supposed to land there. You're on your way to becoming one hell of a pilot. Oh yeah, that was all right, wasn't it? <laughs> I can't believe I pulled that out. <laughs> right, training navigation. Oh dear, this is where it starts to get interesting. I did it though, didn't I? See, we always get there in the end here. <clears throat> I'm uh, I'm not at that stage yet, Ferrara. I'm not at that stage where we're putting in... You can see I'm just doing the tutorials. Hello, Kingy. <laughs> Hope you're good at geography. Have you seen my streams? Yeah, I will do. We'll, we'll do loads of requests in the future, but for now, I've just got to do the tutorials, haven't I? If you want third person, press the N key. Awesome. I see that. I see that. Yeah, I see that. How long will you stream for? All day. I'm not going anywhere today. I've always said, oh, nice. Yeah, nice. Great. Oh yeah, oh we can understand a little bit more about what's going on here, can't we? Oh look at that, yeah, I gotcha, I gotcha. We're going to focus this lesson on navigation prep and procedures. The fundamentals of getting from point A to point B. Step one, putting some distance between us and the ground. What we're doing? We're we're going, are we? Okay. Ready yet? Not yet. And up we go. Oh, you got. Oh, okay. You got to start the stopwatch. Have you? Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> it's fine. I've got this. All right. I did though, didn't I? All right, we're off. Now keep climbing around the airport till we reach 5,800 feet. 5,800, got you, sweetheart. It will tell you when. Oh, okay. You don't start it now. Okay. You might as well just buy an actual plane. <laughs> yeah, you might be right there, Bungle. No, you're not that. You're not that right. It's fine. Yeah. Oh, I like it. I like that. That's cool. Oh, and of course you've got the views there as well, haven't you? Oh, I like that. That's good. That's cool. Um, shit, how do we get back? I like that. Okay. Well, I've got a first generation uh, Titan X and you can see it's running fine. You don't need um, the highest one. It Obviously it's lovely. Saying, but good navigation starts with good departure prep. Let's set up the aircraft for the first leg of your trip. Set cruise altitude. How? What? 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 Set it to what? Um. Set it to what? Does it want me to do something? What? You want me to do something? Um. Will. <laughs> yeah, you can zoom with a scroll, yeah. Um. Set cruise altitude. I'm not sure what it wants me to do. Yeah, I'm not sure. On the left, it's not giving me anything. Um, maybe someone will tell me. Can you bang, ban that um, simmy? Uh, absolute cock. 
5800. Where does it say that, though? I need to know where. Where does it say that? Where does it say Attitude? that? Check. Now for your heading. Oh, she's she's at me. You need to set and maintain a heading. You want to rely on your heading indicator. Compasses are prone to errors, especially during turns or while accelerating or decelerating. Where does it say 5800 though? Go Where does it say that? Your plane above the airport. What, what do you mean above the airport? Oh, I can't see the airport. I'm in a bloody plane. Oh god. Uh, can we get rid of this thing? Get out of it. Departure position. Oh, she told me in the beginning. Okay. Oh, there's no mods. Okay, not a problem. I can do that. Yeah, you can play it without a joystick. You don't need a joystick. Absolutely not. I'm too high, aren't I? Currently, I'm at um, 6,400, aren't I? We need to go down. It's a bit of flappage here because we've got some wind. Yeah, Fatina, yeah, it's all it's all live. Yeah, I'll be streaming uh, Train Sim World 2 on Wednesday evening, actually, um, before release. Before, yeah, I'm going to struggle on this one. Th this I'm struggling on straight away. Um, I'm struggling here. Uh, yeah, 40 degrees. Where am I looking for that? You're going to have to help me out. 40 degrees. Shit. Yeah. Forty degrees. Um, let's have a look. So it's not there, is it? It's the compass with a plane thing in the middle. Okay. What? What? That blue? No, that's the ground speed, isn't it? Oh. Oh. Okay. 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 How do we do it though? Uh, oh shit! Right. Okay, I understand. So we've got forty. Oh god. So fucking <laughs> hell. Right. Okay. Oh, Just above the yoke. Yeah, I got you. We need to validate the time. That's a fancy way of saying start the clock. Okay. So. We're going to struggle with this one, so I'm going to need On to do this a couple off, of times. You can see our next waypoint, Munns Park. Is it a 41 degree heading about five minutes away? 41 degrees. Navigating is basically okay. flying a given heading for a given amount of time. Sometimes you deviate, but if you track the time flown from your last known position, you'll always have at least a range yeah, see like a hammer. of current position. But I've got no problem struggling because not everyone in this 450 room um, is going to be an expert, are they? It's we nice if we can get it together. Or decrease depending on the wind. That's why at your next waypoint you'll want to compare your estimated time and route with the actual time flown. Validate your estimate and ah, your Ah, okay. Okay, so 3 is 30, right, okay. Um, so 30 is 300, is, is that right? Shoot that balloon down. You remember that from the original, don't you? Yeah, of course. Well, we're, we're, you know, yeah. It's how it is, isn't it, Madman? It's the one. I don't, I don't mind being a noob. So, 30... Um, so, Munns Park is 40. Right, so that's 40, isn't it? We're at 40 now, really, aren't we? 
in between three yeah that's 40 okay so 343 am I right in thinking that the 30 is 300 oh 3 is 30 30 is 300 yeah that's what I said a second ago okay got you got you Tokyo and will come in Tokyo gotcha it's all over the place I'm downwind again on I should I, I shouldn't have to put flaps on should I oh yeah the airspeed is very low oh god yeah Right, we'll get we'll get there. We'll get there. I'll definitely do this a couple of times this one. Cuz this is hard, isn't it? Now we're getting into flight sim territory, aren't we? It's all right to take off and drop it down. This is flight sim territory now. So we want to um yeah. My um, it's still low though, isn't it? Let's speed up. Let's speed up a little bit. Yeah, no flaps, please. No flappage. Yeah. Yeah, flaps are are up. Here we go. Yeah, it's automatic. <laughs> right, now I'm a bit more in control, just a bit more. Okay, so now we're at, we are at um, 40 degrees because we're on just between the three and well, we're on the four, so that's fine. Four means 40. Good. I got this. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. Coffees, teas, teas, anyone's anyone for coffees? Coffees, anyone? That's all right, Coda. It's all good. All right, so five nautical miles, and then we're going to come round to thirty. So we're going to come back this way, aren't we? Yeah, we're going to come back to the left, aren't we? Again, I'm trying to get an understanding. Hopefully this is helping you as well. If you are um, going to be playing later on and you're an absolute noob like me. We can work it out together. This is not the time for glossy um, video, edited videos with no problems, no fault finding. Just, oh, that's how to do it. We don't do that here. We work it out together. Okay, Monk, I got you. Yeah, I've got you. Oh, well, this is good, isn't it? It seems, so far, it seems like a really sort of accessible um, simulator. I'm liking it so far. Oh, oh, but someone just said I've got to um, build my altitude. Yeah, because we're, we're way too high, aren't we? Why have we got a stopwatch anyway? Uh, what's she, what's she give, giving me a bloody time for? It's why I'm watching it and I'm learning. Yeah, we can do it together, can't we? Right, we need to come down. We're too high. If that 5,800 feet is a sort of marker for the whole trip, we're way too high. does look good though, doesn't it? Look at that. <laughs> Love it. What the boats use, yes, yeah. Oh, here come the experts. Oh my god, trim it! Yeah, I know, I know. Me and many, many, many other people will be uh, new to this. Five minutes this way, ten minutes that way. Yeah, yeah, I've got your monk, yeah, yeah. Why is the update so big? Well, Addy, you can fly anywhere in the world. It's not going to fit on a fucking floppy disk, is it?
<laughs> he says, okay, we're learning this together. Right, I'm still too high. I am too bloody high. Yeah, don't 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 be that guy. Oh, he's not always oh, doing it wrong. Oh, he's just installed it and he can't fly already. You know, we're just learning together. It's all good. There's no message on when it's coming out on Xbox just yet. There's updates, David, but I can't say anything at the moment, unfortunately. I feel like I'm too low below that um, waypointer, but I'm, I'm actually, if I look at the dial, I'm too high. Best way to learn, exactly. We learn together. There's, there are experts, but nice experts in the chat who are willing to, you know, um, be a little bit understanding and, and give advice. So that's good. That's what we're here for. Oh, look at that. Bloody hell. That is pretty cool, isn't it? Fucking hell, look. Yeah, there's a lot of people disappointed, and a lot, a lot of people just um, assumed that it was out on Xbox today, which says a lot about their marketing, really, doesn't it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, Gods, can you do um, do the business on that one as well, please? Look at the name. We'll do that straight away, get rid of that one. I don't know about Zero um, Codus. I mean, there's Minecraft, which I suppose wasn't um, wasn't Minecraft to start with. I suppose. Hang on, uh, forty. No, no. Uh, it's telling me to go that way, but forty degrees is this way, isn't it? That's forty degrees there. Oh shit! <laughs> yes, we've got a crash. No, I wasn't expecting moving uh, traffic, yeah. No, I know you are, Codus. I know. I know. <laughs> yeah, we've got a crash. And <laughs> dental records. Yeah, exactly, Yong. Yeah, but Game Pass, they meant Game Pass PC. You didn't have time to text your relatives. Well. Right, let's listen now. Let's I've listen. I've said, flying is free. Oh. Open skies, endless possibilities. But to fully enjoy it, you need to be prepared. We're going to focus this lesson on navigation prep and procedures. The fundamentals no, you're not, Will. of getting you're not. from Perfect. point A to point B. Step one, putting some distance between us and the ground. So I didn't say anything about 5,800 feet though, did it? <laughs> Rules are there to be broken. Where's this info about 5,800 feet? Yeah, definitely young. Yeah, no, their marketing wasn't brilliant on this one. Fly wherever you want. Oh, okay, so there's no... Yeah, I've got you. Well, I should have pulled up by now. That's what she said. So we haven't got to worry too much about um, height then, have we? We can just enjoy it, do the waypoints, right, away off. we go. Now keep climbing around the airport till we reach 5,800 feet. Ah. Oh, 
right, Codus. Bloody hell. I thought you were at work, Codus. Yeah, the game uh, feels great, Matthew. Obviously, I'm a tutorial based at the moment, just getting used to it. Just be high enough not to hit the trees. So we're just coming up to 50. Oh, is the minimum? Gotcha. It goes without saying, but good navigation starts with oh, good Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Friend. I didn't think Let's about stalling it, did I? For the first leg of your trip. Right, so we want to set the cruise altitude. We want to get right up there. Right up there. Yeah, That's it is coming, though, check. Young. That's the main thing. Now for your heading. When you need to set and maintain a heading, Want to rely on your heading indicator. Compasses are prone to errors, especially during turns or while accelerating or decelerating. Go ahead and position your plane above the airport. I probably could do a barrel roll. No, I don't think I'm meant, meant to set the timer yet. No, no. Right, we're at 6,000, so let's not get carried away. That's fine. That's it. No, not that one. That one. Yeah, they haven't told me to do the, st the top watch, uh, stopwatch just yet. Right, so we're not worried about um, altitude so much. We'll keep it around 6,000. The girls want to see animals. I said there'd be one in the corner of the street. What, top right? <laughs> When she tells you, yes. Right, so we, we've got to go to 40 degrees, and that's just after the, the free, isn't it? Oh, one last bit of departure prep. We need to validate the time. That's a fancy way of saying, start the clock. Start the clock, here we go. Let's start, is that started? On the nav log, you can see our next waypoint, Munns Park. Is it a 41 degree heading about five minutes away? Got your toe, Ken. Navigating is basically flying a given heading for a given amount of time. Yeah, definitely, Graham. You can get it for a pound uh, to start with, so at least you can try it. From your last known position, you'll always have at least a range for your current position. <laughs> can you do anything other than fly? I could maybe dance. We all know speed can increase or decrease depending on the wind. That's why at your next waypoint you'll want to compare your estimated time and route. <laughs> Validate your estimate and your progress. I can't wait to get a better TV because I don't think it's displaying it very well to me, but it looks fantastic. Okay, so that's fine. <laughs> Go inverted. What upside down? Get out of it. And does it have four different modes? Yeah, it does look good. Yeah, I can't believe how good it is as a package. Yeah, it, it's, I mean, look at what we were playing the other day with X-Plane. I know you can get loads of mods and, and all that sort of stuff for X-Plane, but out of the box, there's no comparison, is there? This has come on leaps and bounds, it really has. Look at the little cars down there, look, oh my god, it just gives that realism, doesn't it? Yeah, it's got drone cam, which I haven't even touched at the moment, yeah. Right, I think we're doing all right. Yeah, we're, we're doing all right. Let's uh, let's relax. Let's trim it. A little bit of extra speed. We keep that just above sixty, don't we? 
<laughs> Papa Wheelie. Yeah, graphics are amazing. And it's going to be in VR. Oh my god. I think this is one I would actually play in VR quite a bit. I'm going to do whatever the tutorials put me in. So at the moment, um, it's just a Cessna. I don't know whether the tutorials move on to other planes, but we will most definitely do it. I'm not going anywhere, right? I'm here all day, okay? What do you mean connection lost? What are you talking about? I got sent this, so it's just a standard uh, version, but we'll upgrade it. Yeah, I mean, Im imagine, uh, and especially something like this, quite sort of tight and snug. It is going to be epic. Yeah, it is going to be epic. How'd you see chat? Yeah, I can put a little window up to sit there. You won't see the window, but I'll, I'll see the. Um, the window. Will make your game lag? No, it won't. It won't. I can't wait to do long streams of just um, flying from here. Let's do a turkey. Let's fly to Turkey. I'd love that. But so far, so good. And it is only the Cessna I've used, but I like the Cessna anyway. Right, so we're about 7,000 feet. The airspeed indicator is about 6,000. Is that 60? Yeah, 60 knots, isn't it? So we're doing all right. The revs are at 20. We're, we're doing fine. Let me know if I've read that right. <laughs> if you're in fifth gear, knock it down to first. You do a flip. No, we don't need any more power. No, I don't. I don't think we need more power, Dandy. Is, uh, anyone else think we do? The revs are over on the right, as I understand it. I definitely want to do um, some UK stuff. It's just so much to do, isn't there? <laughs> Less power, more power. 65, yeah. You could fly. I'd like to fly to the Isle of Wight, actually. People keep asking me what, um, where you're going to fly. Yeah, I wouldn't mind doing an Isle of Wight, actually. Go visit the motherland. All right, Andy. All right, Andy. Yes, it's um, it's quite special, isn't it? <laughs> Skegness is a must, yeah. Blackpool, oh my god, yeah. Yeah, everyone, uh, Cornwall, yeah, definitely would love to fly to Cornwall. Um, uh, Game of Muscle, he, I saw a video, he popped up, where he went to Nürburgring. I'd like to fly to Brands Hatch, it's just down the road. M2 bridge. Oh God, stop it! I'm I'm, I'm getting excited. <laughs> that boy isn't as classy as it used to be. Was it ever classy, Codus? Every pier, yeah. I'd actually like to fly. Uh, cool. Once you start thinking, I'd like to fly around the whole of the the coastline of the UK. That would be that would be quite good, wouldn't it? White Cliffs of Dover, oh my god, yeah. This game is going to be epic, isn't it? let's be honest, yeah. Yeah, and this is only, uh, uh, this is just the beginning, isn't it? Level off at 8,000, gotcha. Oh, we could do all the F1 tracks, couldn't we? Oh, bloody hell. This is going to be a lot of fun. 
yeah, you're going to be getting lots of this, so hopefully you're up for it. But look at it though, look. Good. You made it to Munns Park. Okay. According to the nav log, we've got one more stop. Right. Flagstaff Pulliam Airport. Yep, which is 343. I've got you, which is, we're going to look at 30. That's fly by sight, isn't it? That's that's called fly by sight or something, isn't it? Right, but let's um, let's look at the altitude. So we're gonna come around here to three four three. So thirty four basically is what we're gonna do. Right there it is on the. What are we looking at? That, that's the compass, isn't it? No, that's not the compass. The one top of your screen is the compass. What's this called? This little one with the aeroplane on it? It's the... But yes, we're on 33 or 34, so we're in the right place. <laughs> if not, what is VFR? I don't know. I'm going to be streaming Train Sim World Wednesday night, tomorrow night. Oh, we've got to reset the timer. What? Why have we got to do that? What? Why have we got to reset the timer? She didn't say that, did she? This is starting to give me the fizz. <laughs> it's giving me a touch on Boggy, I'll be honest. You know? Visual flight. Yeah, yeah, I've got you. And I like the relaxed feel of it as well. It's not like you're in a pilot, uh, pilot, uh, pilot <laughs> fighter pilot jet. It's very slow, very relaxed. I love that. Yeah, I love that. This is giving me a touch on for actually flying in real life. I'm going to buy a plane next week. <laughs> Visual flight instrument. Yeah. What that little thing with the with the plane on with the compass headings. That is the VFR, is that right? No, you wouldn't, Monk, you wouldn't. Which I think they should change, really. Yeah. Yeah, we don't need to climb anymore. Oh, I'm ready for Ryanair. Oh, God, yeah. Oh, I got... No, I got you, so no, it isn't. It isn't called that. What's it called, then? The little thing with the aeroplanes, with the headings on. What's it called? Oh, it is the VFR. Okay, okay. No, it's not the VFR. <laughs> Just means you're flying. Okay, not the instruments. Okay, that's fine. That's <laughs> on girls is getting excited about this game. Right, are they really watching me? Because I'll um, I'll keep it clean as much as I can. No, the compass is up the top, isn't it? Just called a compass. Yeah. Heading indicator, gotcha. Yeah, the camping trip was absolutely epic, Mark, yeah. Yes, there is. Alright, here we go. Yeah, there's a step up for everything. What game do you not have a step up? Oh, set up for. Oh, I see what you're saying, yeah. Um, uh, bike racing? I haven't done yet, but I don't even know what it is, yeah. Well, I know what a drone camera is, but... Yeah, lovely, Graham. Thank you very much. Absolutely adore it. Right, we're at 8,000... Well, just over 8,000 feet. Let's go down a little bit. Hello, Eric. How are you? And thank you to everyone coming in. I do appreciate so many of you... Uh, being here, I would love it if you left a little cheeky like. How many likes have we got? 
that's the first question but thank you for being here feel free to subscribe as well tomorrow night i'm going to be playing train sim world 2 early on the channel so um if you haven't already subscribed feel free to subscribe I mean, can you look out the front without without the cockpit animation? Um, you can sort of do that. That's that. If, is that what you mean? Yeah. See, like, will you coming back? Right. Um, let's keep that there. We're we're on the right way. We're on the right place. Oh, you can use an Xbox controller. Okay. Yeah, I have played Farming Sim. There's loads of Farming Sim on the channel. We've got an awesome farm, an epic farm, with a pro farmer um, looking after it. Yes, but completely about the cockpit. Um, I Maybe, maybe, yeah. This is a bit where you realise the bits between taking off and landing don't involve much. Yes, they do. Restart it. Next step is setting up to enter the traffic pattern. We've got clearance to enter the downwind leg and land on runway 21. Keep your attitude, then follow the standard pattern. Oh shit, okay. So at the moment we're not... We're not doing any more, um... We're not doing any more on the compass, are we? We're following their waypointers. We've already done that 34 bit, haven't we? We already got there. Now we're going down, so yeah, I don't think we're doing that anymore. Let's just move that out of the way. Oh, that looks so nice. Look at that water, look. Yeah, that's just a heading, isn't it? Yeah. I know, Andy, it's crazy, isn't it? That is crazy. You shouldn't vibe. Yours is a, yours is a beast, isn't it? sure it was right oh yeah there it is there it is okay yeah I know how to do this oh we're turning already but that's the runway isn't it why why are we turning already unless we're gonna come down and land the other way oh whoa, 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 whoa. no we're not going yet are we I got you yeah no we're gonna land that way for some reason that term was um, putting me off is this the Red Arrows training? Yeah. Yeah. It is Kelly, just not yet. Oh, we're on a downwind, so I'm going to put some flaps on, right? I'm going to do that. No one has to donate. It's all good. That's not what I'm here for. If you want to, go ahead, but that's not what I'm here for. Yeah, put the flaps down, that's fine. You put on full landing flaps. Um, are you telling me to, or... Um, I'm going to leave it as it is. Right, we're going to turn now. That's all right, Kelly. I think the marketing has been a little bit weird. So many people assumed it was Xbox today. Now, you can't blame people for that. It must be something in the marketing. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's not. It's not coming out for Xbox just yet. I've lost the runway, I think. Oh, no. Uh, is that the runway there? That's the runway there. Yeah. Is it? Yes, it is. So we've got the final turn. <laughs> yeah, I'm loving it, Henry. How are you, Finally, mate? A landing on runway 21. Here we we'll go. This one done. I'm going to go with some more flaps. Oh, I'm loving this. I'll tell you what, I've been... I know I'm a little bit haphazard but I think I've actually been better than I thought I was going to be right, 
we're, we're coming in a little bit toasty just here. It's fine. I know I landed before the threshold, but that's my first land in there, so it's all good. It's all good. You're not going to be perfect on the t on the tutorials first time, are you? Or I'm certainly not, anyway. <laughs> I'm not sure what she wants me to do now. Maybe we'll just taxi up here. <laughs> that was like a Ryanair landing. That was okay though, wasn't it? I mean... I don't know if she wants me to taxi up here. Alright, successful VFR flight in the books. Not Happy bad. with that. Not bad at all. Yeah. You buy a ticket. <laughs> Make it one way though, Stuart. Save yourself some money. <laughs> right, what's next? First navigation solo. Oh shit. <laughs> Just make sure no one actually needs me. Two seconds. It's fine. That's all good. Any landing you can limp away from is a good one. <laughs> Everyone okay? We'll ask him in the back. Does anyone know, are the tutorials all in the Cessna? Which I've got no problem with, but it would be nice if they chucked you in a few different planes. Oh, it took me about five hours, Michael. Yeah, exactly, Kearney. You can get Game Pass for a pound, can't you, for a trial. Um, so it's a good way to test your PC, I suppose. <laughs> They're on the phone. Yeah. There's a lot to learn here, but I'm up for it. Yeah, it's all in the Cessna, that's not a problem. I just hope the other plane scenarios give you some kind of tutorial, though. Right, so this is... You are going solo on a full BFR flight. Oh, shit, okay. You'll be departing Flagstaff Pulliam Airport, handling every navigational step on your way to Sedona. So we're going to go to 16, and then we're going to go to 22. It's all you. Okay. Uh, track IR works? I'm sure it does, Taylor. Yeah, I'm sure it does. Tell me some more about... Blast but, well, I can't tell you any more than I told you in that video, uh, Kelly. I don't know if you've seen my video. Um, but, yeah, I can't give any, any more information out, unfortunately, at the moment. So is it just a demo? No, no, Kearney. No, no, the full game on Game Pass. What I'm saying is, is that you can get a trial of Game Pass for a pound. Um, so you don't have to sign up and spend loads of money, you can get it for a quid, see if you like it. Sat in the garden under some of a bit, oh awesome. Uh, well we're just gonna, we're gonna do what we've just done a minute ago, but we're gonna do it all blind, and I think this is probably gonna take a few attempts, but it's fine, we'll get there. Yeah, why do we why do we have to do the timer? I don't, I don't get the timer bit. Why do we have to do the timer? You got ultimate anyway. Get it downloaded, Kearney. Thank you, Kearney. Right, let's trim there so we don't have to hold that back. That's cool. I'm getting used to this. So, um, oh, she'll probably tell me when to do the timer anyway. So I think the first thing to do is we're not worrying about headings yet. We're just 
raising ourselves up. More XP you get, yeah. This seems like a very accomplished simulator, doesn't it? I mean, look at it. <laughs> you can actually see all the roads there. Oh my god, that is cool. That is cool. Yeah, and, and the lighting as well. The lighting is fantastic. Very, very good. Oh, that's a nice shot. Look at that. Oh my god. Okay, you can see some of the cars doing a dodgy sort of following a dodgy pan, but come on, you know, you can't really be picky with that, can you? Oh, 6 minutes 49. Oh, okay, okay. Um, okay, not a problem. Compare actual time. Oh, yes, of course it is. Yeah, of course it is. You set that for 6 minutes 49. I've got you. Yeah, I've got you. Okay. But when do I start that, though? Set cruise altitude. Um... When does it start? Okay, above, above runway for centre. Okay, where's the runway gone? I see what you... I see... Yeah, I, I understand that totally. No, not yet though, is it? We've got to go over the runway and then we start it. Yeah, I got you. I totally understand that. See, this is why I like doing it together, you know? And other people in the chat now... That uh, Is that the runway? That's not the runway. Other people in the chat will be like... Right, I understand that. There's a, there's a lot of information here without having to sit on Google and search for it, which I really love. Okay, here we go. VR is coming. Yeah, VR is coming. Yeah, and I'm sure there's... I'm sure there's... Yeah, see you later, Madman. I'm sure there's a lot of people sitting in the chat that are going to play it tonight. But yeah, we're learning together, and I love that. I don't want to just put together a glossy video where nothing ever goes wrong. There's no point in that. There's no point. Right, okay. Are we over the runway yet? No, not yet. Yeah, but that's not yet though, isn't it? Um, yes, I've heard of your disability, Kelly. It's all good. It's all good. You, everyone is welcome here, mate. You are more than welcome. Right, now, we're going to there, which is 16, basically. But they haven't told me to do it last time, when we got over the runway, then they said it. I suppose I'm over the runway now, aren't we? Okay, let's do it now, then. Let's do it now. Let's get my head in, then I'm going to set the... Um, right, so, 16. Sixteen, and I'm going to start it now. That's it. Now we're going to fly here on that heading for six minutes forty-nine. Brilliant. No, I know that will, but you get some help, don't you? Top right, yeah. Good night. Yep. Yeah. What you going? Are you having an early night, fake man? Good night, mate. Escape won't uh, pause it. Yeah, escape pauses it on mine. Right. I totally understand that now. Thank you for that explanation that just absolutely clicked yeah absolutely although it's still saying top right position aircraft above runway center i think that i've i think i've shot off too early does anyone else think this i think i've shot off early yeah i don't think um yeah, I think I think I'm gonna restart this, you know. What does any of the pros think? 
Yeah, I'll use live weather. Of course I will. Why wouldn't you? Yeah, you weren't over the centre of the runway. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. You time, yeah, you time the legs, yeah. Gotcha, Billy. Gotcha. Oh, can you imagine flying over Las Vegas or Dubai? Or Butlins, Skegness. I love Butlins at Skegness. Hello, Mark. Absolutely love Butlins. We've had so much fun there in the past. So much fun. Y'all ready for this? You'll be departing Flagstaff Pulliam Airport, handling every navigational step on your way to Sedona. Okay. So what we're going to do, we're going to turn around and go right over the middle of the runway, and then set the head in, and then set the timer. No, she's with me in spirit. She's actually a ghost. <laughs> Wouldn't go back. Oh, right. Hello from England. Yeah, hello from England as well. Here we go. Pull up, pull up, pull up. Right, we don't need that just yet. Let's get rid of that. Let's get more confident. We're all good. looks nice, doesn't it? It looks good. It runs well as well. Yeah, Max is doing very, very well, thank you. Yeah, how much did you lose? There's a story behind that. Right, we're climbing up to 8,000 feet. Oh, not that fast, though. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, that's cool, Will. Oh, without a doubt, snowy. I mean, I'm gonna need. It's gonna need cleaning. Put it that way. Smudge. There's a bit of smudging going on. <laughs> yeah, the outdoor stage. Oh, okay. Oh, well, they've moved it to sort of outside of they Mark. You in reds tonight, are you, Mark? <laughs> Right, a bit of 8,000 feet, here we go, just going up just a touch. Is there gas? Not, not, not from me. Right, there is our cruise altitude. Uh, 987 Cayman S, that line. Right, so where is the runway? I don't think we can see it yet. It's there, okay, that's fine. For COVID. Oh, I've got you, Mark. That sounds quite nice, actually. Yeah. Drinks to the table. Bloody hell. You wouldn't have got that before, would you? No, we love Butlins. We've had some epic times there. We used to um, go at New Year, mostly. Look at the lighting, though. Okay, so once we get over the centre, then we'll set our head in, then we'll set our timer. That's what we'll do. Yeah, I know. Um, yeah, it's, it's a little bit misleading, isn't it? Oh, 
Hello, Rebecca. How are you? Thank you, Jerome. Yeah, I, I love it. I love the car. <laughs> yeah. So we're just going to stay on the centre until top right it moves on. That's what we're going to do. We're not going to do anything yet. Thank you, Brady. So we're just gonna we're gonna stay there until, until right here we go. Start the stopwatch. That's it, and we're gonna go to 16. Nice and gentle. There's no need to. There's no corners in the sky, is there? We can just take our time. That's it. There. Perfect. And now what we're gonna do is we're, we're just gonna we're just gonna relax because we've got six minutes. 49 uh, before we reach the Munns Park. <laughs> Just because no one else likes them, yeah. I can't believe I got it, but I don't talk about it too much because I don't want people to think, oh, oh, you know. <laughs> See you later, Goofy. Can't, right, that is it. We are on a nice relaxing. Um, oh, actually, we need to just come this way a little bit because otherwise we're going to be well out of the heading, aren't we? Oh, nice one, Dazza. That's the paid for one, isn't it? Is that the first bit of paid for content on there? See you later, Will. So if I. I am at 16, aren't I? Which is 163. I am there, aren't I? I love the idea of that 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 stopwatch. It just made sense perfectly. Where would that be on the actual plane, though? I mean, I'm guessing it's. Oh, I'm guessing it would be here, wouldn't it? The graphics are lovely though, aren't they? Look at, oh my god, look at all this, look. <laughs> awesome. Alright, just keep my eye on that head in. On your wrist, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, alright, Graham. <laughs> There's a clock. Oh, of course there is. Yeah, yeah, of course there is. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, simulations. Thank you, mate. I love it as well. This is cool. Absolutely love it. And you would, if you were up here, you would just look around, wouldn't you? You just look around, lose yourself in this magnificent flight you would just look around wouldn't you just enjoying everything I'm sure that all your troubles would just fly away up here pardon the pun right we need to just go over here a little bit oh definitely John yeah I remember an old game on my um, dad's MSX uh, flight sim 747 predictably and I always remember it just had green and blue <laughs> for the ground and the first time we managed to take to take off I'm sure my tummy went funny being a kid oh my god we're taking off and all it was was just the green ground and the blue horizon and then all of a sudden oh, you've got this in a in a blink of an eye this is why I love gaming so much because I've been there right from the start like a lot of you um, lovely people have it's not just something that I've gone, oh, uh, let's pop into this. Is it, oh, is this what it is? No, I've been there from the very, very start. And I love that. Absolutely love it. Yeah, Warthog, Graham. Yeah, Warthog. Hello, Frederick. How are you? How's Norway today? 
Oh, look at that sort of haze effect. <laughs> this is really good, isn't it? And that skybox as well. Perfect. I can't wait till it rains. I'm hoping one of the tutorials is uh, bad weather. That's what someone hinted at earlier. Right, we're just going over a little bit, so let's get it back on heading. That's it there. Are you starting to be too high? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, we are quite high, yeah. Yeah, England's lovely, mate. Well, I mean, I don't know, I don't think they know what they're doing yet, Jason. I'm sure I'm sure this is going to be on the next gen of console, of course. Are you running ultra? Yeah, t but 1080p though, does it? Because the only TV I've got in this situation is a 1080p. Um, yeah, which I'm thinking of maybe just replacing with a, a better 1080p. Because if I, once I go 4K, I've got to turn the settings right down, and I'm still only streaming to you in 1080p. So actually, I'm probably better off playing it in 1080p and streaming it in 1080p and then I'll get those frames but the TV I've got isn't very good it is a flat screen, it's a few years old now Toshiba 32, I don't think it's got any gaming mode or performance or anything even Windows just looks washed out Discord looks horrible and you can't really see the wire it's, it's, it's horrible but um, yeah, it is 1080 Ultra yeah there is Billy, I've just spotted that thanks to someone I think we're doing alright you know I feel like I could get in a real plane now and just go for it. <laughs> just joking. This is what I like though, the fact that it's nice and... Um, oh, yeah, nice and relaxing. Oh, that? oh, nice and relaxing. Six minutes. Right, okay. Yeah. 49. Oh, nice one, Dazza. I'm not hungry at the moment, Jamie, but I will I will go off to do something. Then I'll be back straight back all evening. You got a good question. Well done, Bryce. Right, here we go. So next we're gonna go to twenty twenty one, which is two two. Right, we're going to reset, and now we're going to go to over here. Oh god, it hasn't um, it hasn't ticked off top right though, is it? Hmm. So there's 22, and if I set the timer, but I don't think that's going to work. Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Start your clock again, why? Yeah, it hasn't ticked off Munns Park, so I don't think I reached it. So I'm probably going to fail this bit, aren't I? Yeah. Oh, love it, Wiley. Yeah, love it. Nice, a good challenge. And look at it, it looks beautiful. What do you think? Do you, uh, uh, oh, hang on. No. Oh, no. Okay. I think we might be alright, you know. Let's reset it. Reset. Reset. And start. I think we're alright. So, 20, yep, yeah, we're on the right. Oh, God, I think we're alright. Reach Sedo uh, Sedona airspace. Clouds are beautiful, aren't they? Oh, I won't be streaming anything Thursday. Right, so we've got 4 minutes 57 here, and we're on the right track, absolutely. I'm so glad that we're doing this together, working it out, because I think I would have been stuck on this one. If I'd been on my own, 
you know, you, you need a little bit of help, you know? Oh, it's happening to you, is it, Stimson? Yeah. Week streaming on Friday? Uh, I'm not sure. I think I'm going away for a few days next week. I can't remember what date, uh, what date it is we're going. I know my daughter's coming down Friday. It's my wife's birthday on Saturday. And then I think we're going away for the week next week up to, um, oh god, what's it called? Forest of Dean? I'm sure it is. Near Wales, isn't it? Or is it in Wales? So yeah, it's summer. It's family time. This is what happens, isn't it? It's important. Right, 22... I actually feel I've got quite a grip on this plane as well. We're not all like, we're not all the altitudes all over the place. We're doing all right. I'm actually quite pleased with this one. I think they're going to do them as a purchase flight. Apparently, London's available, and I think that's been um, handcrafted. My specs, uh, i9, um, uh, 32 gig of RAM, and a first-gen Titan X. Yeah, they're probably, that, that's probably a way for them to earn extra revenue for it. Right, we're only doing this heading for basically five minutes. Oh yeah, oh god, look at that. Oh my god. That is cool. Bloody hell. <laughs> There's me, look. There I, there I am. That is cool. That is cool. Can you open the map? I mean, I don't know. Has it even got a map? I don't, I don't have no idea. Land on runway 3. Shit, I don't even know where it is. What, what do you mean? I'm not ready. I'm not there yet. What are you talking about? No, we've still got time. Hopefully we'll visual it. Alright, will it... Oh, hang on. There it is there. Oh, maybe... Okay. Okay, let's get rid of that then, because we're actually here now. We're actually here. The trouble is... going to do it my way now. Yeah, definitely, Graham. Amazing. I've no idea if this is right or not, but this is what I would do if I was up in the plane. We've overshot a little bit. I think because I reset the timer, didn't I? Yeah, I know there's options up there. What sort of options are they, Tokyo? That's fine. Let's straighten up. Look at the runway, which is there. That's fine. Straighten it up. Look over. Well, there, there it is up there. That's fine. Not a problem. Oh, it map up there. Okay, okay. Right, we're going to slow down because we're coming in well too fast. Going to put flaps down. I know the uh, angle is terrible, but I can correct that.
I've probably done that wrong. And maybe we was even meant to come in from the other way. I've no idea, but this is what I would have done. My survival instinct would have kicked in, and this is exactly what I would have done. So let's, uh, let's see how we get on. Yeah, definitely, Steve. It's lovely, isn't it? A bit more flappage. I've got a feeling I'm coming in from the wrong way. I really have. I would blame your keyboard there, um, systems. I mean, I'll take it you've done a full restart. Welcome back, and well done. Whoa, yes! It's clear you're ready to fly anywhere on your own now. Pfft, so anywhere. Just anywhere. Oh, I'm absolutely Some people say the over the moon with that. I say, it's just the beginning. Just the beginning, let's go. I'm actually really happy with that. I've got a feeling that's the end of... Um, the training menu so we can just go and do some stuff now I'm gonna to nip to the little boys room because I've been streaming now for three hours just sitting there <laughs> well I don't know um, systems I was giving you a suggestion I, I presumed you were looking for suggestions um, okay two seconds nip to the little boys room straight back and we'll work out what we're gonna do next Right, so that's flight training, and it says here activities find your next challenge. We've got um, free flight. Okay, let's let's find our next challenge. Landing challenges and bush trips. Okay, attempt to land in trying conditions at a wide range of airports. You're happy for me to do that? I think that's the next sort of um, uh, natural progression, isn't it? Oh no idea, Steve. Why? What, what you? What you planning, Steve? <laughs> what you planning? Let's just make sure no one does need me. Two seconds, because the office is still open, so uh, it's all good. Right. Yeah. Oh, giving away Discord chat in Discord. Well, just ban them. Yeah, just ban them. Ask, ask him to be banned. Uh, landing challenges. Let's, let's go there. Oh, famous, epic, and strong wind. Okay. Well-known locate. There's a lot to do here, isn't there? Well-known locations and challenges that are well within reach. Focus on fundamental landing techniques, precision, and smoothness. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. You don't have the power. 
Who's doing that anyway? Oh, look at all this. Look. Oh, my good God. Well, we'll start Jackson straight away. At the base of the spectacular Teton mountain range in Wyoming lies Jackson Hole Airport. This remote airfield may be known for its awesome or inspiring setting. However, its high altitude, short runway, and rapidly changing weather conditions are truly what makes pilots take notice and take extra care. It looks cool. It looks cool. Uh, right, let's get in there. Could this be on there? I've been waiting for this game for ages. This corner of my room, and it is only a small gaming room, but I've dedicated this corner to Flight Sim probably about eight months ago when I redecorated it. And I've done no Flight Sim on the channel. So this corner of the room has just been waiting, basically. Waiting for today. So, uh, no, I'm definitely up for this. I've been waiting for it for ages. So let's go in there. Yeah, a little more practice on runway lineup, absolutely. Let me just see what's going on here, because we don't want anyone annoying, do we? Let's have a look. Let's get rid of them. They're done. They're gone. Right, okay. Oh, look at this. Okay. Well, so this is a Cessna as well. Oh, my good God. Look at this. This don't seem right. Oh, God. What, have I got control already? What? What? Where, what am I doing, though? Where's the land? Where is the landing? Where's the runway? Oh, look at this. Oh, my God. I can't see anything. I don't know what the controls are. <laughs> no, that can't be right. <laughs> Bloody hell. Talk about chucking me straight in. See, in a way, I was hoping that like, the game wouldn't do that. Because I haven't got a clue. haven't got a clue about this aircraft. And it just wants me to start flying it. haven't got a clue. Is that it just to the left? Oh god, I don't know. Yeah, in a way, that's disappointed me a little bit because I wanted help with each one, you know? Because I've gone from a Cessna to this. <laughs> Maybe it's on the other side of that mountain. But such a bad pilot. I know, Uncle. I know. There's plenty of other pro streams, though, isn't there? I mean, YouTube hasn't got a shortage of... Um, of flight sims is it directly in front slightly to the left oh 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 hang on <laughs> whoa 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 i got this a dinner service will commence in half an hour is that when dinner oh i have booked a hot meal kaz yeah i have booked a hot meal is that when dinner will be ready thank you my darling Oh, this ain't no. This is this is not going to be pretty, is it? There's flaps. We got flappage. That's no good. I can't see. And oh, that's better. I did forget about that. To be fair, the fact that you can move that up like that. <laughs> it still wasn't that bad, though, was it? You got flappage, yeah. <laughs> there was a little bit of flappage going on there. I do apologise for that. What did it think of that? What did it make of that? Okay. Oh my god, it's got leaderboards. Did you know about this? Did anyone know that it's got leaderboards? Oh my god. Right, we're going again. It's got leaderboards. It's got bloody leaderboards. Right, we are literally going to try that again. That's really good. Let's restart that. Yeah, I didn't realise it had leaderboards. That's fantastic, that is. All the passengers accounted for. I will try a top five landing, Uncle Drew. Like I say, this is not a professional 
This is not. I'm not a professional. <laughs> Top ten. Actually, I should take notice of this. This is what it's telling me, isn't it? Go straight and then to the left. Yeah. Right, I forgot about that. So at least we can see where we're going now. Oh, I can see the airport up there. Okay, this is good. Trims, uh, trims are fine. I'm fine with trims. Um, yeah, it's almost, think of it as just holding the stick up or down for you. To save you holding it, you just trim it. Hello, Lorenzo. How are you? Oh, that feels scruffy. Flappage. See, the thing is, I've been doing all the tutorials in the Cessna, and I've got no idea where my airspeed is or anything in this. And I'm a bit disappointed that they've just chucked me in it, to be honest with you. What do you mean, don't sink? Don't sink, don't sink, don't sink. What's he saying? How'd you turn that off? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I don't. Whoa, we're up again. Oh my good god, we're doing that one again. <laughs> yeah, of course Jay, I'm actually playing on Steam, the Steam version though. Airspeed on screen, left side, okay. Uh, was that a better position than last time? I can't remember. 1,899, we'll try and beat that. But yeah, of course you can have me, yeah. <laughs> Kangaroo Airlines. So in about a half hour, I'm going to nip off, have some, have an evening meal, then I'm going to be back. Or right, for the rest of the evening, we're going to be flight simming um, all night. So yeah, I'm going to be gone for about a half hour, then I'll be back. And like I say, I'm going to be playing Train Sim uh, World Two on the channel tomorrow evening as well and I might try and fit in um, some more flight sim tomorrow during the day actually I think my wife's going out during the day so it seems a perfect time to get back in the rig doesn't it Unless you find a Cessna on a world trader. I reckon I could do it. I'm coming in way too high, aren't I? Way too high. You just need a HDMI cable, Bryce. Oh, thank you, Zevo. It is nice. I've been waiting to use it uh, for a long time. Horizontal on the left. Uh, yeah, okay, it's right. Mm, I'm still having trouble reading it though. I suppose the the, the Cessna is so analog, isn't it? And this is quite a digital machine, isn't it? So I need to. I was really hoping it would give you a little bit of help with that. I'm coming in too low again. He's saying he's giving it the don't sink thing. God, scruffy AF. Don't 
It's a very different plane to the Cessna. Very different. I think that will beat 1,899. Hello, Reese, how are you? No, nope. <laughs> 1,913. You can actually make it worse. I'm sorry, I'm not going until I've improved on that. Hopefully you're alright with that. Still, it's a good way to practice, isn't it? And there's loads of airports and loads of uh, did, uh, loads of stuff on there. Did you see the blue box on the runway? I didn't. Is that the lights that tell you whether they're too high or too low? Right, ready to fly. Look at that. Look at that. Bloody hell. It's a really nicely polished game, isn't it? And it's almost a bit like Gran Turismo gives you that sort of car porn. This is aeroplane porn, if you, if you like that sort of thing, isn't it? Are they going to sell in CX? Um, no, I think it's digital only. I think someone said that to you. Oh, have a look, it looks like the spot. Okay, yeah, I've got you. Right, let's have a bit of flappage, because we are coming in, aren't we? <laughs> My heart club. Yeah, more flappage. This feels better. It looks so pretty, doesn't it? But like they said, it's quite a short runway, so I think I do need to hit it at the, at the very start. Oh, I can't test yet, Stimston. Oh, I'm really happy with this one so far. Really happy. Just download only, David. Oh, come on. Come on. That's all right, isn't it? Where's that going to put me? I'm pretty happy with that one. What do you think? 1,925. That must be because people are playing it now, surely. Right, I'm going to do one more on there and then we'll move on. This is what it's all about, isn't it? But nice bit of practice. Yeah, the wheels sound really good. All oh, this sounds nice. I don't know about how loud it is for you. If it's, I mean, no one's complained. They said it's about right. But when you put the flaps on, of course, all flight sims do it. But it really does sound nice. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not sure if they're going to do physical for Xbox when it comes out. I doubt it. I should imagine it's going to be download only, personally.
Full flaps is on. It is coming to Xbox. They said it's coming to Xbox One, so I can only um, I can only presume it definitely is. But they're just not really. Um, yeah, keep pressing it down yet. That's that's full flaps. There's a blue box, okay. I'm obviously too low, aren't I? Uh, do I see the blue box? I think I do, actually. Do I see it? Yeah. Whoa, whoa! It's fine, it's fine. I just got uh, unlocked an achievement for that on Steam. Yeah, I got you just buggy, yeah, yeah. One thousand three hundred and sixty two. I've got to have one more go, because now I can see the blue box. Yeah, and uh, this is getting better. One thousand three hundred sixty two. We can beat that. Absolutely. Just one more go before we move on to the next one. Yeah, I don't know the name of it, but I've seen the videos, yeah, I've seen the videos where they're standing on the beach, aren't they? And the plane comes right in. Oh my god. Yeah, that, that looks crazy. Who would try and touch an aeroplane? Turn in later. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're totally right. Of course you're right. You know what you're talking about. It is, Kev. It's very good. Yeah, I see what you mean about turning in later. Yeah, turning in so I'm straight with the, the runway. At the moment, I'm turning in now, aren't I? Let's have a bit of flappage, though. That's it, now we can turn in. More flaps. Right, so we want we want that blue marker, don't we? speed, yep, got that. Yeah, graphics are lovely mods. What about that that um that warning though? Should we be worried about that? Yeah, I'll be coming back on. I'm just gonna have some dinner, and then um, I'll be coming back on with some more flights in. Nah, we're just short. We're just short. Okay. <laughs> Stall! Bosh! Oh my god, let's see what that looks like. Boom! That's like GTA, isn't it? <laughs> right, okay. Let's move on to the next one. <laughs> we got almost got into the top 1000. <laughs> <clears throat> I 
right activities so we've done that one let's go uh, oh no no we haven't done it no that's right we've got loads there they're the famous ones what about epic face the most iconic and dangerous places to land in the world I mean come on that's surely not we'll give it a go let's give it a go just to try a different plane and different situations oh wow Aspen Aspen oh I don't know uh, Marky yeah it'll buff out yeah um, also known as Sardi Field is a high altitude regional airport nestled in the Colorado Rocky Mountains to land on runway 33 pilots must contend with a steep approach though the through the area's mountainous terrain and a strong chance of bad weather obscuring the path that sounds like a bit of me yeah that's a bit of me oh look at what we're gonna have to do we're gonna have to um, descend come through the mountains and in there okay Yeah, so I don't know if they're going to tell me when to turn or whether we've got to do that sort of visually. This is epic, isn't it? <laughs> we're doomed! <laughs> no, we're not. You know me, we'll always get there in the end. But I do appreciate you coming in. And like I say, uh, I've been streaming for just over three hours now. In about 20 minutes time, I'm going to nip off, have my dinner, so the stream will end. And then I'm going to come back on for the entire evening, right up probably until early hours. Um, just playing Flight Sim all evening. So if you want to come back and join me, this would be a good time to subscribe. Don't forget to leave me a little cheeky, cheeky like on this stream. Um, but yeah, let's get on with it. Okay, I've got no idea if this is going to give me any help at all oh my good god <laughs> so it was sort of descend wasn't it and then do it and then do a sort of cheeky left. I think it's over there, isn't it? So we're going to go left and then right here. Can you imagine living underneath this flight path? The lighting is fantastic though, isn't it? Oh, is that the actual runway there? Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, God, okay. This is obviously going to take a few attempts. I mean... Come on, you know. I'll try it on my first attempt. I'll definitely try it. Oh, God, it looks fantastic, doesn't it? Bloody hell. Here's the blue box. Oh, my God. This, is, this ain't turning out too bad, is it? It, oh, okay. Second faults. Oh, no! <laughs> you did not land on the designated men runway. <laughs> I got it now, though. I got it now. It hasn't got that um, sort of stuffiness of flight sims that I've played in the past. It seems really accessible. It looks fantastic. It feels like anyone could play it, not just flight simmers. You know what I mean? I think that's the, the vibe I'm getting. It is made for everyone. It's definitely made for, hopefully, a broad audience, which is great. The more people that get into it, the better. Right, flaps down. I mean, look at this. More flaps. Nice bit of flappage. Never hurt anyone.
It feels like it's too low. I mean, look, I can almost touch them. Surely not. Is it me or is it just getting darker than last time? God, okay. Okay. Oh shit. It might be alright. It might be alright. It's not alright, is it? It's fine. That was a little bit of luck there, wasn't it? <laughs> that didn't turn out too bad at the end. No, take it back. We did all right there. We didn't do all right, but you know what I mean. Where are we in there? 321! <laughs> Beat that, mofos! Oh my god, I'm free. I'm going again. I can get better than that. 321 in the world! In the world! Yes, we're having that. Okay, not many people might have tried this challenge, but I'm still taking it. 321. I reckon we can get top 5, surely. <laughs> Only 320. Get out, Marky. Bloody hell. Unbelievable. You, you, you know, come on. Right, let's give it a bit of that. I like that. That's that's quite nice looking like that, isn't it? Right, okay. This is taking a lot of concentration, you know. Interesting approach, but nailed it. Right, trim the arse off of that. I love the fact it's got leaderboards on it. That that is, it just adds another level, doesn't it? A bit more flaps. Oh, I'll try them all, Cameron. We've got a whole evening as flight sim after I've had my dinner, so we will be flying them all. I just can't believe it. Look how good it looks, look. More flaps. They need to do a Don't Sink, Don't Sink 2020 remix of some sort, don't they? Oh, we're coming in. Oh, we're drifting. We're drifting. We're drifting, everyone. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We got this. We got this. Here we go. Oh, I can land, though, can't I? Come on. I might mess the approach up, but I can land. Our actual la pilots, yeah, yeah, you're right, yeah. What lovely flappage.
Anything, um... Oh no, still 322. Uh, okay, 326. <laughs> I've tried it. Okay, alright, that's why I'm top 300. <laughs> alright, let's do that one more time. I'm not one for just, like, doing one and then moving on to the next. I want to try and learn from it and just get better each time. Oh, flappage. Yeah, flappage is a tech term. Yeah, yeah, I'll ask any pilot. Yeah, I'll ask any pilot if they want to see some flappage. I'm sure they'll all say yes. You was right, Marky, yeah. Well done, you. Right. Hola, Carlos. <laughs> right, let's trim the fuck out of this. living under this flight path. That would be quite epic actually, wouldn't it? Love it, Craig. Yeah, yeah, fantastic. Right, a bit more flappage. Extend the flappage. doesn't David <laughs> cabin crew pre prepare, prepare for flappage Just missed the box there. Whoa! It's fine, don't worry about it. <laughs> Dog sick. <laughs> Dog sick. Can't you see it? Where's that put me? Three hundred and twenty six, look at that. We're getting up there though, aren't we? I need one more go. All right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just need one more. <laughs> it's great, isn't it, Dazza? Yeah, it, it's a big hit, isn't it? It is a big hit. <laughs> your head. Don't worry about your head, young. All right. Put it in some flappage. You'll be fine. I know, it seems to um, give you a position in on your last attempt, which I'm not 100% happy with. Because, you know... Right, there's flappage, stage one. Yeah, definitely Stimson, yeah. The last one, it did um, it did put you lower than it started, so I think it gives you it on your last one, which is a real shame. Suppose it keeps you trying it. Is everyone happy with the camera top right? I mean, I know it's 
sort of taking up the scenery, but at least it's not taking up any um, any dials, is it? Just for future reference, more than anything. Oh shit. Oh god. Let's go back around. <laughs> there it is. Oh, get in there. I'm sorry. I can't go just yet. <laughs> dog sick. Dog sick. You need to turn um, into the wind. Yes, David. Yeah, I think you're right. Hello, North. How are you? <laughs> Rank four fifty. Only three hundred and twenty six have played it. No, I can see I can see me getting a top ten in here tonight. Okay. Yeah, that was gonna be a reach around that one. I haven't buzzed the tower yet. Not intentionally, anyway. How cool would it be to be a pilot, though? Look at it. It'd just be epic, wouldn't it? Slow her up a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. First flappage. The controls, I mean, traditionally setting up a flight sim and getting all your controls would be enough to put anyone off, really. But because it's sin, what joystick I'm using, it's gone straight in and just set it up, which is lovely. No, no, Josh, not yet, but it is coming. Oh God, that's not that's not the best approach, is it? I should think so, um, Boggy. I could be a Playboy pilot, couldn't I? Dog sick, dog sick. Here we go, here we go. It's fine. It's fine. We got this. We have got this. Have we got it? Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, fucking land. One more. I, I've got to. I've got to try and at least do it properly before I move on. <laughs> Maximum crappage for that one. <laughs> oh god. Thank you for sticking with me, though. You know I'm a noob. You know I'm just having fun with the game. There's no professionalism here. There's no oh this learning about flying. I'm learning about flying. You might be learning as well, or you might be just laughing at someone learning. It's all good. It's just a video game, and we're having fun with it. That's the most important thing. Let's not forget, she's just a video game, but a bloody good one. <laughs> no wonder the dog's sick, yeah. Even though it's a flight sim, you're allowed to have fun. Hello, Richard. How are you? Richard Feynman. Why are you called David Bailey? Where's your Richard Feynman gone? <laughs> yeah, you're learning a lot here. <laughs> yeah, all right, Mink. <laughs> How many planes have you broken? Yeah, it makes it fun. Yeah, I think a lot of people forget, especially in simulators. They forget to have fun. 
you know, don't always have fun. It is a video game at the end of the day, isn't it? Let's not forget to have fun. Same when I do racing, you know, there's it, got to be that fun element there. I need to learn. I think I think what it is. I'm going to go over to the left, just a little bit more. Oh, I got you, Richard. Oh, of course, Richard Feynman. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Oh God, where where am I actually? What the? What is going? What? Whose idea was this? Whoa! Drifting the arse up for that. Look at this. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm using the warthog. Oh god, here we go again. Yeah, it's over there, sweetheart. Oh god, this is this is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt everyone. There's the blue box. Have that. <laughs> One more. That's all right, Daniel. How are you? And this is why you don't text and fly. I know. I know. It's fine. We're, we're going to go in slow on this one. We've done it a couple of times. We've had a good couple of runs, but I seem to have... Um, yeah. It's all good. Right, ready to fly. <laughs> Power slide in the jet. It had to happen though, didn't I? It has got an addictive quality. I think one of the things that's making this section a, a, have an addictive quality is the fact there's a leaderboard. When is it we have a leaderboard in flight sims? Not that I know of. So I'm very happy with that. Yeah, raise your seat up. Yeah, I'm all good. Thank you, Daniel. Right, flappage. Yeah, less power. And I need to work out that corner, don't I? Oh, don't start that already. the dog sick again I mean that shouldn't realistically be uh, going off should it in real life yeah <laughs> yeah probably monk yeah the blue box by a little bit it's that turn yeah it's that turn maybe I need to go out wider I'm sort of cutting the corner on I like Deloy says yeah okay need <laughs> Max's air traffic control let me have one more in there all right just just bear with me all right 334 yeah look people are people are, are, are updating it as we play <laughs> someone get that poor dog sick Hello, Jan. How are you? Yeah, look, it's it's a lot wider, isn't it? Hello, Snoop. How are you? Okay. Seat up. Pulled back. Let's do it. Oh, 
that's it there. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Ayman. <laughs> turning early and getting straight. Um, I have sort of been turning in earlier, though, haven't I? Let's try it like this anyway, see what happens. Oh, it's definitely a challenge, yeah, absolutely. God, can you imagine this in real life? Right, bit of first bit of flappage. No, I'm cutting that corner again, aren't I? God, Will's don't coming sick. at the worst time. Dog sick. There's going to be plenty of dog sick here, Will. Oh yeah, you like that? You like that, do you? you like? Oh, you like that shit, do you? Oh yeah. Let's see where that puts me. It's got leaderboards, Will. That looked better, didn't it? Let's see what that's put us. Three hundred and thirty ninth in the world for that one. Yeah, doing landing challenges. <laughs> Trying to anyway. Um. Let's go back to the activities menu. See what we got. I will be slipping off for me dinner in a minute. I don't know how long that's going to be, but uh, um, I will be back on afterwards. Yeah, a bit heavy, but it's fine. Okay, so we go back to activities. Bush trips. Test your navigational skills. Probably leave that for a little bit. Probably. So we've got the uh, current live event, landing chat. Oh, so there's a live event, is there? Okay. For the next two weeks, complete in a new time-limited landing challenge to reach the top of the leaderboard. Chor Corchevel Airport is serving Corchevel, a ski resort in the French Alps. The airfield is a very short run. Okay. <laughs> it's just there, isn't it? Look, it's crazy, isn't it? Course is fine, Thomas. Corchevel. 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 Corchy flappage. Right, I can hear plates being dished up, so I'm going to make this my last go. But like I say, I will be back. Don't forget to subscribe. Come back and join me later on this evening. Also, tomorrow, um, I'm going to be playing Train Sim World 2 on the channel, showing you the London Underground. Um, and the fast ice train as well. So don't forget to come back for that. That'll be tomorrow evening. Uh, but in a minute, I'm going to go and have my dinner. Then I'll be back for the entire evening. Oh, okay. Oh, this is a nice little plane. Okay. I can't even see the can. Where is the run? Where is it? Oh, shit. Oh, I like this plane. This is. Oh, yeah, this is nice. Right, this is going to take a, a, a couple of attempts, because I don't know if it's down there or down there. Where is it? I need to find where it is for the first one. Is it over that way, or is it over that way? Is it up here? Yeah, it looks like a map on Battlefield 5. Yeah, you're right, except this... Uh, 
This is a bloody flight sim. Is that it there? Because this is obviously my practice one. Let's just have a little look. I think that's it there, isn't it? Right at the end. Yeah, here it is here. Flappage. No, I haven't gone past it. It's here, isn't it? It's here. Oh, he retracted it. <laughs> oh, too low. Okay, like I say, this is just the practice one. Whoa, 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 whoa! Brace, brace! I like the way it doesn't do explosions and all that shit. We don't need it. Right, I can hear my dinner being dished up, so I am going to go now um, and uh, go and have some dinner. But like I say, I'll be back very, very soon. It won't take me long, and then I'll be on for the entire evening. So if you want more Flight Sim, don't forget to come back. Please leave me a little like if you haven't already done on this one, but I'll see you soon.